Yo, hello. Hello, everyone. Welcome to stream. Hello. I was feeling extreme itchy today. I was going to stream 30 minutes ago, and then I decided, you know, what if we make the perfect audio setup in OBS? I couldn't do it. I, I, I can never do it. It's, it's, it's too hard. <laughs> I, I never feel like I get any closer. I don't know why. I subject myself to it, but we do our best every time. <laughs> we do the best. And in the end, you just sort of accept that's life. And you know what? That's, that's what this game is about as well. Grim Fandango. <laughs> right? Perfect segue. Or rather, how, that's just how death is. Hey, because it's about the afterlife. Is, the, is this camera go okay? Is this camera go okay? You know? There we go. <laughs> Too much fiddling with um, audio, not enough fiddling with uh, camera angles. Hey, hello. Welcome. Welcome, welcome. You know what? One thing I can do is I can get this um, my, my clothes out of the way. I'm drying clothes on stream right now. Let's get that out, out of the way. All right, I'm back, and the clothes are gone. Well, mostly. <laughs> let's have let's have some 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 good manners and stream here. No need to air our dirty laundry, <laughs> or my or my clean laundry, I guess. <laughs> <On stream. laughs> Welcome. Oh, oh. So things have gone pretty bad here already in Grimmanango. We're in the um, third act, third part at least. Um, we've managed to escape Rubikawa, finally, and it kind of appears that uh, we've been out to sea a little bit longer than I suspected. And we went out to sea to chase, uh, what's the name again, Mercedes? Mercedes... Uh, something. What was the name again? It's eight, eight something, I think. We're chasing her. She went on boat. Now we're going on boat as well. And um, I guess now assassins are on board. We got a little mail from a bird friend who um, delivered a message that Salvador knows there's uh, assassins on board. And that that's uh, where we are now. They kind of just left it exactly like that. We are on board, assassins on board, and Sorry, we go inside here and there's a bunch of sprouted fellas. Oh, no. I tried to go through that door to get back again, but the game stopped letting me, so I, I imagine it's not doing too important over there, I don't know. This can't be happening. Hey! He's back here! Sack him! Oh. Those guys sure look like some assassin types. No good. No good crowd. Oh, no, no, yeah, they, they disguise themselves as custom officials. That's right, yeah. Don't worry, Captain. We're safe in here. Okay, let's just set the explosives and get the hell out of here. Very typical custom official behavior. Hey, Glorious. Um, I like your sailor getup. Is this the modified ship engine, Don? Gladys sure did a number on that old diesel. If it were just a little more powerful, we could probably tear on out of here. I tried. Oh, I tried. Yeah, Gladys is... failed. It's oh, no. Not powerful enough. Oh. Hey, maintain, sailor. Poor guy. He's pretty good. He did, he did say to the old captain, I guess I'm the captain now, he told the old captain that, like, he was gonna do this in engine. I swear in the cutscene... Um, that um, uh, Manuel was wearing a like a Guy Fieri T-shirt with like flames and stuff on it, right? I swear he was. Now he's like wearing like just a regular ass sort of sailor um, turtleneck. But I, I swear he was. And it was matching as all with the ship. Which had, uh, like, flames on it as well. It's like a white ship with flames on it. Oh my god, that sound is horrible. 
Um, speaking of sound, I hope, hope uh, stream sounds okay <laughs> after after the 30 minutes I spent on it. <laughs> Hopefully I didn't make it sound any worse. You can let me know if uh, anything needs to be adjusted. Louder game or louder me. Or if, or if everything's just perfect. Right, well, that's, that's a whole thing. I can do that. I'm really curious about that shirt. I wonder if um, the, the game looked... Um, different between Remastered and the old version, where he had like a flame t a shirt on. Or maybe if uh, in the cutscene he, he had like a design that didn't end up going with in the end. And that's why he had the shirt on for a while with the flames on it and doesn't anymore. These assassins are taking a sweet time. Well, I tried to figure out how to. I think the best uh, way to use this engine would be the control drive over the ship, as opposed to the hands-on method. It's bolted down. I think the best way to use this engine would be the controls over there, as opposed to the hands-on method. You haven't tried, have you? Did you give it a uh, look? See how it feels. <laughs> so now I have an anchor, so now things different. I have no idea what these cutscenes are meant to represent. Other than maybe that I'm stuck. Oh, there's another button there. That's, that's the other anchor then. Why did they show me like different uh, angles? I didn't see this button there. There we go. Both anchors. Now can I do something? Look, that sound is so horrible. <laughs> Thank you, though. I I'm glad that the stream sounds okay. Maybe I should ask Glorious for help. Because clearly I'm very confused about what I'm doing over here. Yeah, let's exit those controls. Hey Glorious, uh, you've got anything you want to tell me? No? No, I guess not. Hello, welcome. I hope you're doing well. Welcome. Hope um, the headache is uh, not quite as bad today. Can't reach. Can't reach. Can't reach. Oh my god! I, d I think I just figured it out. I think. I think I'm trying to fish something up with the anchors. Um, so, I guess we should, like, look at the cutscenes and see if we have anything kind of, like, next to the ship. But yeah, the game is very unclear about what's, what's happening here. Headache all clear, Jaws still having a fun time. <sighs> Hang in there, buddy. Hang in there. That sort of pain really sucks, man. Like neck and jaw and all that stuff are so so uncomfortable. Like pain in like the head, like face and stuff is so horrible. Like some of the worst pain I've ever felt is when I had like a really nasty sinus infection. That stuff is horrible. Like um, ear inflammations as well. Oh, oh, buddy, ear sinus. Yuck. Not picking that up. What the fuck is this?
Yeah, see, I've kind of dragged the anchor a little bit now, right? But why? I feel like they could have done a better job with the presentation of this puzzle. This seems absurd. Like, yeah, I, you could say all you, all you like about that puzzle with the tree making the noises. Remember that one? The bloop, 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 that one with the wheelbarrow? Um, like, you had no fucking idea what, um, what that, that puzzle was, you know, asking you to do. No idea at all. But at least it was pretty obvious what you were doing. Uh, this is like... Extremely dubious. It's like, what the fuck am I even changing? Like, I don't know how to like manipulate these controls enough to say I'm moving closer, I guess. I don't know what's happening. And there's like no feedback at all? Does this like spin me around? Is that what is this? No, I don't know. Like, these forward and back buttons don't seem to do anything. <laughs> you just sort of press them for fun. <laughs> it's a whole hoot. Okay, I think I'm- I think I see what's- uh, what I'm trying to do. Okay, I think I get it now. I think I get it. So I should probably like lower this down now, right? And then go right? Like that. So I can then go to the window and climb the thing, right? What? Should that be closer now? Can't reach. I feel like this chain should be closer now. It, it should be like it was. It was touching the ship in um in the cutscene. But I, I think this, this is the idea of what I'm trying to do, at least. Can I go even farther right, actually? I don't think I can, but let's try. No. So, I don't know if that's the right solution or not. Let's try, try going left and see if I can do the same sort of thing with the other anchor, maybe? Nope, still Can't quite reach. far away. Can't reach. And I assume it's the same over here. Yep. Can I, like, see what the up and down buttons do? If I have the anchors above that? They really just seem to do nothing. Can't reach. Oh. Can't reach. Okay, so that's what I was also thinking about doing. But I didn't quite know how I would go about doing it. It looks like I've accidentally done it. I have now connected my anchors to each other. Does that mean it's taut here? Reach. Uh, it would be tortured here if I pull this button now, right? Can't reach. Wait, that doesn't make sense. It should be tortured now. What if I now pull this one? No, 
No, that makes no sense. <laughs> it's like an it's like an infinitely long chain to this anchor, apparently. Do you have any items, maybe? Scythe, 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 scythe. Okay, I think you have just a bunch of scythes. I don't suppose this does something. Where did your apprehension to messing up your blade go? Motherfucker rubs scythe, uh, like things about rubbing his scythe next to like uh, cat food and it goes, I don't want to mess up my blade. Using his, his scythe on the anchors though, <laughs> like a ship anchor, no, 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 that's fine. Can't reach. <laughs> Can't reach. Can't reach. Can't reach. Okay, so now something would happen if I push this, right? Gladys, cover your ears. What was yeah, stream cover ears as well. <laughs> Okay, we sold it. I, I guess? No? Wait, what? Wait, what's fuck, what is going on now? Can't reach. So why did I do that? Oh Can't my god, reach. I still haven't sold it. Don't mess with these anchors anymore. We might go down with the ship. If I mess with these anchors anymore, we might go down with the ship. Oh, there's uh, holes on both sides. Can't reach. If I mess with the can't reach. I guess let's keep messing with the controls. Oh my god, I've like cut the ship in half. I think. I think that's what it is in playing though. If I mess with these anchors anymore, we might go down with the ship. If I mess with these anchors anymore, we might go down with the ship. Isn't that a point? Um... What the fuck? So, I don't- it doesn't want to touch the anchors at all anymore. If I mess with these anchors anymore, we So what did I achieve? I don't know why I achieved doing that. I just sort of mess around the anchors, as he says. Oh god, they were so patient back there, weren't they? What? <laughs> also, where did the flames go? I swear there were like flames all over the ship. Just a little farther, Gladys. This is fine. Skellies love being underwater in, like, you know, shipwrecks at the bottom of the sea and everything. It's a good aesthetic. We love it. Love it down here. We're gonna become, like, barnacle skeletons now. They love the sea. <laughs> Manny, choking! Mira, snap out of it, sailor. Easy for you to say. You don't have lungs. Hey. You live without your heart once, so you can live without air for a little while. Just until Sound logic. What we're gonna do. Seems we're doing all right with, uh, his, you know, his lungs. All right. I'm a spirit of the land, Manny, not of the sea. Hang in there, Manu. Well, you're doing good. a good job sinking. Is that a... Anglerfish, I will, uh, Hello. Beware, brave captain. Here in the darkest depths of the Sea of Lament dwell the most horrible... 
horrible monsters of all. The Ma'am? fearsome, murky demons of the Ma deep will swallow you whole the instant you leave this pool of light. Heed my warning, or take one step forward and learn for yourself. All right, all right. A year at sea has really changed us. <laughs> the creepy spirit of the land boys, huh? Here comes one now. It happens too quickly. Just a little bit of, of sea spray on you, and uh, you just a changed person. Oh, hello, buddy. I told you skeletons love. Hey, I'm talking to you. Love being at the bottom of the sea. It's aesthetic. Okay, that might not have been a sea monster, but it was pretty spooky. Okay, problem. Oh, I think her days of use are over. I told you that name was bad luck. Hey, sorry. Oh, Lola. Hmm. Looks like I let you down again. When I get it out of the sea, I'm going back home to Lola. So, we just sat at the bottom here. I, mean, I can't get out of the light. I see that fella walking around us. I guess that's important? I have no items. I have the scythe. Can I, like, use my scythe to fetch the light, though? I don't want to mess up my blade. No, he doesn't want to mess up his blade. <laughs> Anchor? Nah, buddy. Or don't worry about it. Light? Gross. Don't rub on my blade, please. Not on my blade! It can't be reaped. Have you tried? Uh, also, I can't. I can't put away my thing anymore. Weird. Huh. I tried using uh, that item on Glorious though, and it just deleted all my interface. That's weird. Hey, buddy. Amigo. Huh? Who? Oh, geez, another. I had to wait so long for him to come back around. That's why I never travel by boat. We've had a little accident. Think you could help us out? Depends on what kind of help you're looking for. Could we borrow that light for a second? Sorry, I'm kind of attached to it. <laughs> <laughs> Could we tag along with you? Well, it's a long walk you're talking about. We don't have any other choice. Oh, all right then. Lift those knees, stick close to my light, and try to sing in key. This little light of mine, Excellent. I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Hide it under some seaweed. No, I'm gonna no. let it shine. Hide it under this some This fucking part. No, I'm gonna let it shine. I do remember some people at this part being very annoyed with this part here. Something very confusing about this and he just sings a lot. <laughs> I don't think I'm going man about heart, isn't it? God is though. Shine. I'm not getting into it. Touch it. No, I'm gonna let it shine. Not gonna let you touch it. No, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. I can't. I can't do anything. I have no, none of my buttons do anything here. And I think you're about to just come back into the light here because I think it's just walking in circles. Get on it. I thought that looked like our ship. That's just a trick the ocean plays on your mind, kid. Makes everything look the same after a while, like you was going in circles. Well, this isn't the kind of progress I was hoping for. Oh, yeah. well, the wet march of the soul ain't for everybody. What are you doing down here? Trying to get out of the land of the dead, same as everybody else. Why are you walking instead of taking a ship? Got sick of waiting around Rubicaba for a boat. Figured I'd make better time this way. Why didn't I think of that? <laughs> well, because you'd end up like this guy, and I, I don't know if you want to end up like this guy. <laughs> we did sink, and we got, got, almost got assassinated, but I think... 
This might have been a better fight. Who knows when that guy start, got started? You know where you're going. See the moon over there? I just keep it on my right. That way I know I'm heading in a straight line. But oldest trick in the book. Yes, his, his navigation trick is to walk in circles. Is everything okay with your eyebrows? Them is barnacles, genius. I don't move fast enough to shake them, so they tend to pile up. I don't mind, though. They're the only company I got. <laughs> Ain't you, boys? How long have you been down here? Well, let me put it this way. I wasn't always this color. Yeah, okay, so, yeah. Walking for a rubber car seems like a terrible idea. Shouldn't you have hit dry land by now? I'm trying to cross a big ocean here, Sonny. What do you know about it? I've already done it. In a boat. A boat? Don't talk to me about boats. Yeah, boats do sink. It, it might have a point. What's the problem with boats? We had such a nice boat. Why is everybody always talking about boats? It's just on our minds right now, you know? It just had an ac accident. Use them, I say. What is a boat, not if not legs for the sea? Let me guess. You died in a boat wreck. A boat wreck would have been better than what happened to us. Led off course by bad equipment, lost for weeks, no food, no shelter from the sun. We'd started throwing the dead overboard. But then the sharks began following the boat. What happened in the end? What happened was, I learned three valuable lessons. Stay away from boats. When it comes to navigation, trust only the moon and the stars. And when there's only two of you left, never, ever go to sleep. Hey, yeah, you know, I guess there's some things there that could help you, maybe. <laughs> some pearls of wisdom, though. How have you kept that light going all these years? Well, I found this coral, this glow-in-the-dark coral. Damnedest thing. Glows like a lightning bug and never seems to wear out. I had some of that once. Made a nice grappling hook. Oh, yeah. I don't think you had what I got, because I don't think you've been to the place where I got it. Where'd you get the coral? Edge of the world, boy. That's the only place Oh, <gasps> flat skeleton nerve. I'd love to see. Could you send for help? Oh, sure. I promise to call for help at the next phone booth I walk by. Could you take us to the Pearl? Ha! You don't believe those old stories, do you? You it's think somewhere in this ocean there's a gigantic pearl that shines so brightly it can be seen from passing ships? And yes. sometimes sailors so allured by its luster actually fling themselves overboard to dive for it and are never heard from again? Yeah, and I think it's right over... Blah! I've been it's right over the ocean there. For years, I ain't never seen it. No, really. The pearl is right over there. You poor sucker, that's the moon! Tell me you didn't come all this way out here to pearl. The moon is the not moon. in the ocean, buddy. Well, I don't want to break your spine <laughs> there. Okay, see you around. Watch out for sea monsters. Who? These guys? Whoa. Oh, no, no. I thought I could, like, interact with uh, the light there for a second. They don't mess with old Chipito. I'm too bright for them. <laughs> also, there are a bunch of sea monsters down here, then, I guess. I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine. Hey, Leo! Lego! 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 Get your own lamp, pal! Whatever happened to the code of the sea? My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. Yeah, get it out. Oh, did I bug the game? I did. The game did not enjoy that I did that. <laughs> okay, it's fine. Don't worry about it. Ensign. Don't worry about it. <laughs> God fucking damn it. <laughs> this can't be happening. Technically, we are only one puzzle away from uh, where we were. Technically, so. Yeah, save early, save often. 
not because like any puzzles are gonna make the game unwillable for you, because the game's gonna just fucking break because you tried pressing I during uh, some sort of gameplay sequence. Uh, let's see if I can uh, solve this puzzle now. How the fuck did I even do that puzzle? Like, I, I don't actually know how I did the thing I did. I think I th I think I know, it, but uh, so I'll give it a try. But it's like this. So you first get this anchor on the left, and I think then you go left. It's, feel free to skip these cutscenes, uh, Man Manuel. I don't I don't need to see this Manny. I don't need to see this these many cutscenes. <laughs> I know we do this that one, and then we go right. That doesn't seem right. Let's see if I'm right. It is right. Okay, excellent. Yes, I, I did vaguely know what I was doing then. The, the thing that really gets me about this puzzle is that they lie to you. Um... Because I, I was kind of trying to do this, but like I didn't get any of, I didn't see any of the results in the in the cutscene. The, the anchors are so far away from each other in like the cutscene where you, where your boat is um, and moving around, you know. Um, Cover your ears. But when you press the the button, then they are like, all tangled up. But when you're like trying to move around the ship, they're not tangled up at all. So. <laughs> They just fucking lied to you. So I, I didn't. I thought I was doing something wrong, you know. I thought I was like not a, a man like doing the right thing. <laughs> okay, there we go. We caught up. Liar puzzle. I'll just quit it with the creepy spirit of the land boys. I definitely go over there first chance I get. But the yeah, here comes one now. Alright, so do not... Um... What? Okay, that might not have been a sea monster, but... I saved it, but it, like, jump really far... What? You alright? Hang in there, Manu. Alright, so this is gonna be quite annoying, so I'm just gonna... Try something here. To save myself a... Uh, some heartache. Does it work? It does work. Excellent. Okay, I've now saved my game just as that guy um, um, passes passes me by here. I certainly can't see why anyone would get annoyed though. <laughs> no, no, no one could get annoyed in this area. <laughs> Okay, yeah, that's it. It always passes. Tampa always passes a little bit every, every time I save. But it should be here in a moment now. Or not? You are not hanging there, Manu. There is. Amigo! Hey! I'm talking! Amigo! Hey! Buddy! What the hell, man? <laughs> Hmm. 
Amigo. There we go. Thank you. Ooh, oh, All right, save right here, I think. Jeez, so I, I don't think I don't want to go for the walk here. But I think the walk is a total um, uh, red herring. Oh fuck me! Got him. Oh, uh, don't, don't worry about it. I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine. I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. This is totally normal behavior. It, it, it's supposed to look like that. Don't, don't worry about it. That's just a trick the ocean plays on your mind, kid. Oh fuck. <laughs> like he was going in circles. Hide it under some seaweed. No. Oh well. This well, hole ain't for everybody. I'm gonna let it shine. Hide it. Under some seaweed. Oh no, I made it worse. <laughs> Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. <laughs> Scare away sea monsters, yeah. Right I'm gonna you let it shine. <laughs> <laughs> Scare away sea monsters, <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna let it shine. Scare away sea monsters. Alright, wait a second, that's not right. Just, no, don't click the walk. Don't click the walk. You're just gonna get upset if you click, if you click the walk. You see? That <sighs> don't wanna break your stride. Is every them? Well, what? Who? These guys? Oh, so many of them. Oh, they don't mess with old ch Pedo, I'm too bright for them. <laughs> Stop right there. Criminal scum. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine. That soul has already been reaped. I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine. I, I don't wanna mess up my blade. Hide it under some seaweed. No, I'm gonna hide it under some... My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. I'm gonna let it shine. No, get... I, I'm gonna... Get back here. I'm too bright for him. <laughs> this little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Hey, Leo! Oh, I think I've broken the game again. Lego! Lego! Get your own lamp, pal! Whatever happened to the. <laughs> Oh shit, did my internet fucking die from how, how bad that broke the game though? <laughs> Stream almost died as well though. I'm too bright for him. No, stop right there, criminals come! These little You are right. Not of the sea. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Hey, Leo! Lego! What did, Lego. What did I do here? Lego. Do not click this hit, by the way. This down here, do not click that or the game breaks. Get your it get it gets so upset. What am I supposed to do? Now let's wait for him to come back. This is dangerous I'm doing here, yeah, but don't worry about it. This point's gonna cause me any heartache. I'm just gonna make him skip really fast in the back door, don't worry about it. Okay, he should be back now. <laughs> Yo, buddy, you wanna you wanna come? Amigo. Amigo. What? I just well this little light of mine I'm gonna let it not picking that up what do you mean not speak that you have to mine. hey Leo what are you doing here Lego 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 Gladys any you wanna help people have been trying to steal my lap all day whatever happened to the code of the sea wait they don't reckon he didn't recognize me is that a thing Gloss, I think I'm going crazy down there, dude. You all right? I'm a spirit of the land. Not hang in there, Mano. I definitely go over there first chance I get, but there's a lot of dark water between here and there. According to our map, I think that's the pearl. All right, speed up, buddy. Thank you. <laughs>
I get I guess we can get this scythe out already and see if I can do something here. What the fuck? No! I don't want to give him the scythe. Demons can't be reaped. <laughs> I love watching him fall back them out. <laughs> Oh shit! That soul has already been reaped. <laughs> what do we do? I have no items. I can pull his thing, but if I do not, I can't press anything. And God forbid you press your inventory while you pull that thing. If you do that, you will just you will just crash the game right there. Do not go in there. Do not go in inventory. I don't want to mess up my blade. Oh, I think her days of use are over. We're underwater. We're not on the moon. I told you that name was bad luck. Hey, sorry. Oh, I think her day. Oh, Lola. Looks like I let you down again. I really don't see anything I can, I can really interact with at all down here. It is just me and the light down here. And, and the guy walking circles around us very slowly. And like, when I'm walking around as well, I can't interact with anything. Um, it does seem like you just sort of... Duck for the for for the ride. Amigo, what? I just. Well, he's fully convinced with different people. Yeah, because he, he doesn't realize he's walking in circles. We've had depends on. No, fuck me. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine. Uh, I'm gonna try something again. Uh, so, uh, so it doesn't break. I'm gonna save here. And then I'm gonna load that. Right, so now it shouldn't be broken. Hope hopefully. Is there else you can do while you have the dirty grip? Yeah. That is something. Oh no! Why are you singing, Lord? Is now is not the time. You're talking. God, they're so confused. They don't understand that I sped this up by 500 times. Could you take us to the Pearl? You don't believe those old stories, do you? You think somewhere in this ocean there's a gigantic pearl that shines so brightly it can be seen can't I passing ships? And there's some skip dollar in so allured by its luster, actually fling themselves overboard to dive for it. Shit, did I break the game too badly? Again? I'm gonna let it shine. Blah! I've been walking this ocean. Was that years. I Manny saying I'm gonna let it shine in the voice of him though? His, his like lips flapped to it. There we go. Okay. Let's drop another save. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine. Hey! What am I supposed to do with this? Follow me. Where are you taking? Oh, there we go. To the moon. The, the crosses did not light up clicking on anything, but yeah, just how did it not click on Glottis? He's huge. That Maybe that's like um a frame window where I had to click on the Glottis stuff. Shh! Something's happening. Manny, what's going on? <gasps> Bunch of fellows. Oh, 
decoy octopus. This is just like Metal Gear. Because it's an octopus. Scary fella. But he's in the light. I don't know, but I don't like the way that thing's looking at us. Nah, I think I can shut down this program now. I don't, I don't think I need to speed the game up anymore now. <laughs> I'm not going down there while that... I can't get anywhere near the sub while that monster's guarding it. Oh, it's just following us now. That's nice. You got my co cooperative. I think we found our transportation. That octopus is tracking us. That's fine. We're equipped. You got the siphon, right? Just give it a little slash. I don't want to get tangled up in those. What is Not that? Quite as famous as the pearl is the slimy barnacle-covered old rock of legend. Push that. When I get that desperate for food, maybe. Can I cut them off? It is the only item I have. I don't want to mess up my blade. No, he doesn't want to mess up his blade. Ugh. Watch those hands. The hell? My scythe. I like to keep it next to where my heart used to be. Maybe if I get the octopus to attack me, it'll go for the rock, maybe? Alright. Why'd I have to go all the way to the back here? You know, to talk to this guy. Uh, uh, look, just talk to him. What? What is the pathing in this game sometimes, man? Where are you going? Hey, Chipito, go for a swim, will ya? You're drawing too much attention to us. Too bad! I'm sticking all right, to I see. Articles on my eyebrows, so don't even think of sneaking off with my pearl. Okay, yeah, that's what I was thinking. I, I'm not going down there while that monster's looking right at me. I wanted to um, to get him stuck in in the uh, the red vinester, but I didn't know how to interact with him. All the time to just talk with him, and when I talk to him, he just takes pulled away with that, and he doesn't want to follow me here, right? Or maybe now it does. There we go. Hey, lay off. I just didn't find the right uh, go, area to press. Let go. Let go. Hey, where are you going? You can't leave me here all alone. Come back here. Ah, oh, put your Peter. She's coming back. Let's set him up. It's such jerks. He had it coming after that uh, first puzzle we had to do with a man. Oh my god. It's an octopus bike. <laughs> That's beautiful. Looks like we're heading south, but there's nothing on that edge of the world except the edge. It really is fun. <gasps> oh my god. Flat skeleton earth. This doesn't seem like good news. It seems like a bad place to be. God, I need a new chair, man. I keep sliding off. Don't ask it's, it's why it's so uncomfortable. I keep sliding off and not sitting in pro uh, problem. Land. It's like I'm sitting on those like horrible benches that they figure, uh, that they like make in order to like prevent people from like, you know, being comfortable outside for too long. You know what I mean? It's, it's got like a good one those, those chairs. Or like. You remember that, like, um, toilet seat someone made up? So that it would be too uncomfortable to, like, be on bathroom breaks for too long? Because it was, like, on a slight angle? Dude, people are... People are monsters, dude. Left to their own devices, people will just do the most horrific <laughs> garbage and imaginable. Oh, hello. Meche. Manny. Meche! Mercedes Meche? No, Meche is short for Mercedes, right? I am your travel agent, you know. By the way, thanks for that bottle of champagne you sent me. It really hit the spot. 
You were headed for a trap. I was trying to warn you. Domino was using me like bait. I didn't want you to end up a prisoner here like me. Prisoner? Where's your cell? Or are you just sharing a bunk with the warden? If that's what Rude. you think of me, then why did you come here? Because Manny, that is. this is where he belongs. Here, working for me. I knew you'd come around eventually. Right or wrong, Manuel Calavera is always with the winning team, right, Manny? That's why you're here now. I'm getting off this rock, and I'm taking all of these people with me. <laughs> Manny, there's no way off this island. I'm afraid you're stuck here in my little executive training program. See, I need you to take my place here, kid. I've got to get back to the city where the action is. Sorry, Manny, but I had to come in. My skin was getting all pruney. Him, I don't need. Bye. Oh, oh no, Gladys, no! There he goes. Grind you to powder for that cow, on. Maybe later. But for now, let me just show you your new office. Bonk. Oh my god, that's tip tapping so fast. Oh, baby, the new boss is waking up. It's like my, it's like the cheats <laughs> got never got turned off. Oh my my cell is just open. Okay, that's weird. Hola, Angelitos. I'll bite you, I swear to God. Please Rip don't bite us. Pugsy, that's why they he had a good run. In the first place. Why do you want to bite me? You're the mean new boss. Mr. Hurley said you were meaner than him. He said you had a bone saw. It's not ready though, don't worry about it. You bite me and I'll sue your parents. Our parents? Our parents? Yeah. <laughs> oh, I got an achievement though, that's nice. My name is Manny Calabella. Oh my god, they're so Still loud. Told us about you. You're the one who tricked Meche. Poor Meche. I didn't trick anybody. Mr. Hurley said he was supposed to take care of Meche, but you stole her case from him. Is that true? Mech is my friend. You can ask her. She talked about you before. Every time she says your name, she looks so sad. I don't know what you did to her, but you're gonna be sorry! Let me see if I can explain this whole thing to you. You see, I had this job, selling travel packages to immigrant souls. If I sold enough of them, I got to leave the land of the dead. Now, I was in a slump, and I really needed a fat commission, so... You're a bad man. Go away, bad man! Yeah, go away! What are you two doing in this cage? Making light bulbs. Look, we're working light as hard bulbs? as we can. Why don't you leave us alone? Oh, are they making like the coral face? Listen, children, I'm here to help. There's really not much more room in here. Your hands are too big to make light bulbs. I'm here to help you get out of this cage. You can't do that. We have to stay here and take care of Mitchet. She'd be so sad here all alone. Sometimes we hear her crying, you know. Sometimes I hear kids screaming outside. They're screaming at the top of the lungs. Uh, I don't get it. I don't get why you gotta scream. I never understood that. My hands are not too big to make light bulbs. Horrible. Oh, why don't you help? My butt's too big to sit on one of those little perches. Um, I'm gonna tell Mecha you said that word to us. See, that's how you scream. Thank you. Bad. I just don't have any of those little tiny tools. That's all. Here, take my hammer. <laughs> well, thank you. <laughs> You know, I really do want to help. Then why don't you? I'm in the Maritime Union. We can't do factory work. I don't know what those words mean. It means he doesn't want to help us because he's mean. No, oh, easy. Thought, maybe I don't. We don't want to either, but we don't have a choice. I'm the one who's going to take Meche out of here. What? You can't do that. Who's going to take care of us? <laughs> we'll be all alone. <laughs> Selfish little kids. This is why we're gonna leave you all alone. We're gonna feel bad about it. I don't. I'm here to help you get out of this cave. You can't do that. We have to stay here and take care of Mitchet. She'd be so sad here all alone. Sometimes we hear her crying, you know. Nice cage you have here. Mr. Hurley grew demon ravens with human heads in here. Is that what you are? If we ever tried to get away. He'd send the ravens after us and let them make nests out of our bones. Ooh, fancy. 
this uh, th these ravens have okay, got a, a taste for the for, for luxurious. Doesn't get any fancier than baby human skull nest. <laughs> There's the hammer. Thank you. Think. Time to make a tunnel. I don't really want to do that. Time to find some some diamonds. So I can mine and craft. Oh, oh, that's a lift. I see. There we go. No, I don't want to be here. I just get to leave my cell here. So what's this operation done? Is this like where all the people I've been... Are you back Transporting end up, just working for this guy. You just want some ice for your head. Interesting. I saw that. She is really hammering it on that cigarette and the ashtray, there, isn't she? I wonder how that's useful to me. I only steal ashtrays from bars. Fair. That's praxis. <laughs> Ow! Oh, my stockings, they're ruined. Got it. And this was my best year. God, I'm a genius. I'm. Didn't even talk to her. You try to have one nice thing on this cruel island. I'll take your stockings, please. Sir, do you have an appointment? I'm going in there to tell Domino my demands. I don't think. No, I just wanted the stockings. Stand a chain of command around here. Pugsy and BB work for you. You and I work for Domino, who works for Hector Lemans, crime boss of El Maro. Well, I think it's time for a little corporate restructuring. Oh. Maybe I didn't get the stockings? Oh, weird. I feel like there's room in here. Well, I'll, I'll look around and see if I find them. I could make a pretty nice, like, um, pop filter with those things. That's what I usually recommend that you do to for the cheaper DIY pop filters before. Taking your first <laughs> Nowadays, they don't even tell you, tell you that there? you need them anymore. Poor Sedley, see. <laughs> you know, if I ever spoke to my boss Hector that way, what are you doing out here on the edge of the world? Oh, I know. I ask myself that every day. But I'm going to train you, Manny, to take my place here running this two-bit light bulb factory. How can you keep little children in a cage? Trust me, it's easier than keeping big kids in a cage. Oh, I, I can attest to this. Go ahead. Good luck. I'll, I'll, I'd like to see you try. Why don't you just sprout me like you tried a Puerto Zapato? That wasn't me. That was Hector. He's so unimaginative. Just wants to tie up the loose ends, you know? But I believe, however, that you can be rehabilitated through honest work. Hmm. That's nice. You and Hector set up a secret hideout to make light bulbs? Oh, no. That's just a side benefit. The real purpose is to have a place we can lock up all those old clients yes. of mine. Yeah, Can't have exactly. good people wandering loose in the land of the dead telling everybody how we stole their double-in tickets. Now can we? You stole all these people's tickets? Okay, how much of this haven't you figured out, Calavera? Kapal would route all the good clients to me after he switched over their tickets to a secret holding fund. I'd cover up the paper trail, and we'd make sure that the pigeon jumped overboard at the Pearl. Yeah, that's why there were uh, so many tickets that the Charlie guy had. I don't know where he got the tickets, but there certainly seems to be a lot of tickets on the street because these guys are taking them I knew it you were getting all the good clients I handled them all except for Mercedes who you hijacked for me in that ridiculous hot rod which I saw by the way last time I was in Rubicava I tell you Manny hot rods like that just don't look safe to me what did you do so it wasn't my fault Mitch didn't get a ticket you stole it. Well, it's your fault she ended up in the forest instead of coming here right away, but I fixed that. 
I'm taking Meche out of this dungeon. Manny, before I found her, She just does mythic level loot. In the petrified forest. This isn't even heroic. This is a very normal dungeon you got here. I'm keeping her pretty comfortable here in my uh, dungeon. Wouldn't you say? One ticket for you, one for Hector. How many more do you need? Oh, Manny. We never touch the product ourselves. We sell a ticket to unfortunate souls, unable to lead moral lives because of the crippling amount of cash they were born into. But you could just take the tickets and leave today. We found a way to make the land of the dead livable. Why would we want to leave? Nice island you got here. Yeah, the previous owners didn't know what they had here. Let us pick it up for a song. They scooped out all the coral they could reach with their crane and then abandoned the plant. But we knew we had what it would take to go the extra distance to the big reef. Are you about to lecture me about the winning attitude again? No! Slave labor, Manny. That's the real ticket to success. No, but, well, it's very upfront about it. It doesn't make it any better. But but I figured he was gonna give me a justification for it. No, he's just, he's just like, no, I'm a terrible guy, Manny. <laughs> Did I tell you I'm awful? What makes you think I'm gonna work for you? Well, there's not much to do on this island if you don't work, take it from me. And think about it, once I'm gone, it will be just you and Meche alone on this deserted island. Don't tell me that prospect doesn't appeal to you. I don't plan to be on this island for very long. Manny, I have all the guns. I have all the transportation. And I oh, have thank you for the follow. Needs. Oh, nice to see you. What are you gonna do? I enjoyed the, the Rainbow Six stream you did. That was a good time. I really want to play some of that someday. Uh, but uh, it's been a while since I've played in the shooters. I'm just... I'm really bad at aiming. I can't do it. <laughs> yeah, always a good time to watch at least. Kill my best friend. The demon? Manny, you can use a demon. Oh yeah, Glorious, I forgot about him. How could I? <laughs> let him serve you food. But you can't ever start thinking of them as friends. It's just not natural. Well, I gotta get back to trying to escape. <laughs> hey, you do that, kid. Knock yourself out. And we're all very upfront as well about how little we care about being here. <laughs> You always meant to play Grim Fandango? Yeah, me too. It, it, it's one of those games, isn't it? People always talk about these games, um, like adventure games and uh, specific ex examples of them, like how great they are. And I was always like, I, I've got to play them at some point. And I just never got around to it. Um, and they, then the remastered version came out and I was like, i got to get around to it. And, and now I just got around to it. Uh, you know what? Uh, it, ga game's holding up pretty well. There's, there's a couple of things which are like, wow, this... this this is a relic from uh, from the past, but uh, there's, there's, there's so many things about Grim Fandango in particular which makes it really charming, and despite a couple puzzles being a bit wonky, sometimes things are a little bit, uh, just a little bit unclear and like extremely arcane, but so there's a few like hits and misses, but like overall there's so many more hits than our misses, you know? Oh, that's what it was. You threw it. That's nice, Manny, but you're not my boss, so really, I couldn't care less. Good, excellent. Carry on. There we go. Now we got the stockings. Well, for whatever purpose we need stockings for. We could always do audio equipment, uh, Manny. You know, a little clear nail polish would fix these right up. Wait, how? D didn't you burn a hole in them? I guess, like, maybe it's just discolored. The only adventure games I really played were Gabriel Knights? Dude, that, that's a classic. I remember a lot of people talking about that one as well. That's an old Sierra one, right? Uh, I, that's, um, that's a live action one, right? I don't I know very little about that one, but I did... Um, I think I played a little bit of um, Phantasmophobia, which I think is similar-ish. Um, to Gabriel Knights, just like a bit gorier. <laughs> Come on, we're getting out of here. Trying to steal my commission from Domino again. Manny, don't you ever give up? 
I'm not after any commission. I just want to get us both out of here. Then why don't you just ask your boss for the day off? I can't believe you think he's my boss. He's my arch enemy. I think he's your boss. You think he's my boyfriend. We don't seem to have a good foundation of trust in our relationship, do we? I think he got on the wrong uh, foot here. The second game was live action, very cool, and the film was sort of computer graphics. Oh, I didn't know that. I also didn't know that there were actually three of them. That's a whole trilogy. That's three of them I need to get around to. I do want to play more um, point and click games in general on stream. I think they're really fun. I think they're really cute. And I, I think it's like actually kind of delightful that some of them are so bullshit nowadays. <laughs> Particularly on the Sierra front, like um, King's Quest, um, all of those quest games, you know, like Police Quest, Space Quest, etc. All of them are like so bullshit. They like have the worst puzzles, kill you all the time. They like make the game unwinnable for you all the time. And I think that's like kind of delightful <laughs> for streaming them. <laughs> For playing them? Oh my god, it's so frustrating. But, you know, sometimes you need a little bit of Genesis Genesis well for a good stream. <laughs> I'm sorry I implied he was your boyfriend. I do trust you. Well, I'm not sure I trust you about that. But I'll tell you one thing that would convince me. Name it. Give me your gun. I don't have a gun. <laughs> That's a nice thing about the Grim Fandango as well. Is that uh, it is from that sort of school of thought that, like, these adventure games shouldn't be bullshit. And, like, there are basically no... No, there are literally no unwinnable situations in this game. There's, you don't lock yourself out of, like, winning the game. Or, and there's, like, no score system or anything like that. Uh, LucasArts made some quite nice adventure games that I really enjoy. Like, uh, Monkey Island is something I, I super enjoyed playing. I've been playing that uh, Reason this Ball, and it's uh, uh, also holding up really well. Nail polish stops a hole on stockings from getting any bigger? Oh, okay. I had no idea. The more you know. What? What makes you think I have a gun? You work for the most heavily armed organization in the land of the dead. Don't try to tell me they didn't issue you a gun. They didn't issue me a gun. They didn't issue me a gun. What, are you on probation? I'm not buying this, Manuel. Manny, why don't you come back when you're willing to deal straight with me, okay? Oh, you're just gonna cut the conversation there because I don't have a gun? Well, sorry. I, I choose to just not... I have a gun. <laughs> that gun. Ready to hand over your heater? I would if I had one. Right. Alright, so I gotta get a gun so I can chat uh, with Meche then. I don't work for the most heavily armed organization anywhere. You know, you're right. There are those rumors of that revolutionary army that's been stockpiling weapons. Actually, them, I work for. Manny, why <laughs> yeah, do you do actually, when yeah. you're willing to deal straight with me, okay? <laughs> but I do work for the Revolutionary Army. Hey, about that gun. <laughs> Ready to hand over your heater? I would if I had one. Right. I think we need to talk. Start talking. You're the salesman. I have a lot of explaining to do. Save your breath. Domino's explained it all to me already. You have a lot of explaining to do. Oh, me? About what? Why are those children locked up in a cage? With the wings those angelitos have, they're the only things on this island Domino can't control. Hey, if they can fly, let's set the kids free to go get help. They can't fly that far, Manny. But they are tiny little baby wings. Domino, and they can bite pretty hard. <laughs> okay, so it would help me a good amount if we could release them then, perhaps. Why did you run out of my office? I felt so embarrassed, and you looked so disappointed in me. I couldn't stand it anymore. Then what were you doing that whole year I was in Ubakawa? I was lost. What did you... I don't want to talk about that year, please. Has Domino hurt you in any way? Not as much as I've hurt him. Boy, can that guy take a punch. Why are you working for Domino? I do what he asks only to protect the children. Why did you take me out with that champagne bottle? I she already told us. To yeah. Stop you from falling into Domino's trap. If you had made it on that ship, then you would have ended up here. Yes. Okay, I'll lay off the questions. Great. Now if we could get you to just lay off the cologne. Hey, I'm a sailor now. We have to wear this stuff. By law. <laughs> Manny, talking isn't helping right now. Okay. Okay. Oh, 
I guess we gotta find a gun then. <laughs> Time to get armed. <laughs> McAllen is uh, in my big list of games to play one day. Oh, yeah, you, you need to play McAllen. It's um, such a delightful series of games. Like, um, one and two are absolute, like, greatest of all time adventure games. Like, they are so great. I love this uh, game so much. Um, and they still hold up. It's not even like you missed out on them. They're still great. Because um, when they dis made those games, they desi designed them with good ideas in mind. They, you know, they didn't add in any bullshit. They just made a really funny and a really fun game to play. Uh, and no drawers. It's, a, it's an absolute delight. It's a great art. Really great art. It's really great music. And like, just really, really funny writing as well. Like, Monk Island is fantastic. So yeah, I absolutely recommend playing Monk Island. Gabriel Knight 2 and 3 also avoided bullshit. You can't progress because you missed an item four years ago. That's great. That's actually great. Yeah, I didn't actually know that, but... Uh, because that is a thing that Sierra is kind of notorious for. Is that whole thing. Um, like, I think they were doing it with like even the later King's Quest games, you know? I know King's Quest V very well. I think that game is hilarious. It's so funny. And um, I'm pretty sure you can lock yourself out if you just throw a pie too early, you know? Then you won't be able to save yourself against the Yeti. <laughs> People always make that mistake, you know? The bigger pie and just eat it? Moron. You gotta save that for the Yeti when you go to the Alps. You fool. I can spin around to convey a belt, which is conveying nothing. Wait, I can go more? No. Well, maybe I can get on this uh, conveyor belt somehow. I think they were pumping out too many games each year. Yeah, probably. They, um, there's so, so many games when you look at the back catalog. I don't know the release schedule or anything. How the fuck did we manage to run up the? What? Man, it must be really fast. Yeah, I don't know exactly like how frequently those games got released. But uh, there's like up to 10 games of each of the series, right? You got like, what? Uh, Quest for Glory, King's Quest, Police Quest, Space Quest. I feel like there might be like one more. Like, the pro probably like a Western theme or more called like Sheriff Quest or something, right? I don't know. Horse Quest. I feel like there's uh, some I'm not um, rem remembering here. But there's at least like four that I can figure right now. Uh, I think King's Quest might have gotten just like two, maybe three, I think. But King's Quest got like eight, right? The other games got like up to five. And then there's like all the other different. Oh my, that's what I'm doing. This thing, it's crane. Let's see. And then it's like uh, all the different little pro projects as well that they made like several of, like Gabriel Knight, um, Phantasmophobia. I keep wanting to say Phasmophobia, but that's a very different game. Oh, I see, you can hold it. Okay. I don't know what this is for. I can't get out of here. There's no ladder. Oh, okay, I can go to each side of the island, basically. The grinder here. These are games where every two years uh, I'm used to push the technology. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's, that's the thing with them, is that, like, while they were pretty bullshit, they were still, like, incredible for the time, right? They were like, quite innovative as well, because I, I, like, um, that was kind of like how you'd adapt like pen and paper games to like computer computer games in a way that uh, has hadn't really been done by by anyone else. So when you got like the King's Quest games, like the, the text parses and everything, that was, uh, you could like in, without having a bunch of friends around and leading your own campaign, you could just. Type, type like, I don't know, touch the bee nest. Oh no, you died. 
And you were like, oh my god, I'm so immersed right now in this in this world of it. <laughs> Be careful, Graham. That's a mean old bear. It's the edge of the world, but not the edge I'm looking for. I don't know. Um... Because I was uh, watching an interview with OG Sierra on this earlier. Ah, that sounds really interesting. Yeah, it did have like a very good perspective of uh, all, all the stuff they released. Yeah, yeah that'd, be, that'd be really interesting. It's not like a documentary they released in regards to like uh, any new releases they did, or is that just like a fun thing that floats around on YouTube? It was also I'm trying to finish them before Infant Walkthroughs. Dude, that was such a different time. Um, like before, like YouTube, you you would just have to like Google things and go to like game FAQs and like hope you find find like a good guide. I was so confused at a lot of a game FAQ guides, man. Some of those were like phrased in such unhelpful ways that like I didn't really learn anything by looking at those things. I don't have a long enough level. You could you could actually have businesses about making game guides that you sold in shops, <laughs> like as books, <laughs> and people would buy them. I bought one. I had one from GTA San Andreas, I think, and um, it was quite, quite nice because it showed you like where the hidden packages were, which were like collectibles and all of that stuff, so you could like complete the game, you know. And like, for a long time, YouTube wasn't even like super nice to use either, because like, um, your videos could only be up to 10 minutes, right? So it was really annoying going between parts, and the quality was so bad. <laughs> so it wasn't even like uh, things really changed for the better. Like immediately as YouTube became a thing. It, took, it would take a few years before people actually made good stuff on YouTube for walkthroughs as well. So there was a while, um, you would have to wait a lot. Not wait. You had a good amount of time before, like, there were resources up for like how to beat games. Yeah. What the fuck am I doing right now? There was just was just nothing to see over here. Oh. Wait. wait. What, what? What did I just do? Okay. I can also press the operate button and then do this. It was on Metal Jesus Rocks. That's a, that's a YouTube channel now. Excellent. I'll check that out. I can put that to my watch later list. Can I use it? It's not a handheld device. Yes, no. This coop looks heavier than my last ship. Hey, thank you for the follow. Thank you very much, buddy. I appreciate it very much. Nice to see you. Always nice to have some new folks showing up. I hope you're all having a lovely Sunday evening. Let's see. Oh, I can't uh, leave because I'm operating the Ukraine. There we go. Oh, uh, never mind. I, I was just confused. There we go, okay, got it. Yes, yeah, see, I drop it this thing if I, if I press operate. Can I do this and then spin around? No. <laughs> I don't get it, man. <laughs> yeah, I hope you're all having. Lovely chill Sunday evening. A, re a relaxing, nice time. I was hoping maybe I'd like chomp something in the ocean though, and I could like drop it here. That does not seem like the case. Those things are dangerous. I don't have the strength. I didn't have to point out to me how dangerous those things are to me, Manny. I am like mortified of like industrial 
hardwood like that. It's so terrifying to me. It doesn't have to be, like, that industrial. Like, I just uh, cannot be around sores. Um, like, um, where I, when I grew up, I had some family that had, like, a, like a circular saw in a garage. And they had to, I had to, I had to like, walk through the garage to exit the house. And I always walked, like, circles around him, the, the fucking saw, because like, I was so terrified of it. I don't like them. They're scary. <laughs> Wait, can I drop the um, the thing here? Okay, that's more interesting though. There we go. Okay, I think I found something a little bit more interesting though. So I guess I can like send something along the uh, conveyor here. And then I can, um, jump it when it passes here. I, I think <clears throat> the game's telling me right now that it would be bad for me if I kept falling down here. I'm just gonna let him. I'm just gonna see what happens. Because I bet Glorus is down here. I bet you are, but nope. That's just a big old ship. <gasps> Glorus! You found him! It seems fine. It's just fixing up the ship. Gladys. You're okay. Well, it hurt a little when I hit, but my head cracked open an aft panel here. I gotta tell you, Carnal, I thought you were dead. Oh, Manny, I've been having a great time. Listen. Oh. I ask you. Is there an engine that can resist the love that's in these hands? Apparently not. Always aspire to be as good at uh, your job as God as his other is, man. I think this baby's our ticket out of here. What a good guy. Oh yeah, good point. I was just wrenching it for fun, but your idea's good too. <laughs> I think this... Oh yeah, good point. I was... <laughs> is he being sarcastic? I can't tell. <laughs> Lum... Lum? I don't know the name, what the name of the ship is. Lament, maybe. Lamer! <laughs> Stop lamen! That's what it says. <laughs> so good to see him again. This has got to be where um, the claw comes in to play, right? Like, maybe I can, um, fish up Glorus with the claw somehow? The claw, like, pinches right here, right? <laughs> Was there nothing down there? Does Glorus just not want to leave? I guess he's busy. We just know he's, he's here, and that's, that's okay. Don't have to worry about it. I think this baby's our ticket out of here. Oh yeah, good point. I was just wrenching it for fun, but your idea's good too. No, he's not sarcastic at all, is he? <laughs> he's just doing it for fun. Yeah, there's nothing down here. You just know that this is a thing. And we do also have the claw up there that we can interact with if I ever get anything here. That I can pinch, but right now it seems like nothing. I can also change the direction in which the conveyor belt is going. Which I don't quite understand. I'm just gonna drop a save here quickly.
yeah, I don't think it changes this, how this works here at all. So the pop down there with Gordas is gonna be absolutely the same, right? Yeah. No frig, God damn it! No, do not go back there. Are there any other parts to this uh, level that I haven't seen yet? There we go. What a loud place to be. I'll try to spend as little time here as I can. Ooh. Huh? Ooh. Oh, you is it? Why, I oughta look at my eyebrows. Relax, we're busting out of here soon. We, we are done traveling together. Oh no. I can't believe we got offended that I got him kidnapped by a squid. But you know, I got kidnapped as well, so I mean, I, feel, I feel quite even. That tool looks a little overpowered for you. Overpowered? Yeah, I'm, I'm telling Blizzard right now, you're getting nerfed. You, say so. you got like nine months minimum before they nerfing you by two percent or something. <laughs> the overpower drill though. Ball was coming for you. Nice drill. drill? This here is a cordless high speed reciprocating chisel. And look, it's a bust all. They bust don't all give to the new guys. A dad all. I like to see you try. How'd you get a bus stop? I'm connected, plugged in, and I had some booty to trade. Trade's the name of the game out here in the big reef. Booty? Where'd you get booty? It's all over. Since the when do you have booty? Precious coins, you people and news to me. Folks never know about it, cause you just never stop and look. Give me some booty and I'll buy our way out of here. I Get him the dinner first, man. This beauty. You traded jewelry and precious coins for a power tool? It's a bust off. <laughs> I want to trade something. Well, you came to the right place, Sonny. What you be needing? A gun. Ooh, that's gonna cost some. What do you got on you? My turtleneck. Oh, yeah, that is nice. Acrylic? No, it's all natural. Oh, too bad. Natural fibers are so uncomfortable underwater. I know, I know. Uh, I've only had the acrylic. Trading comes see old Chapito. He'll do your right. No, 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 let's keep talking. Huh? Oop. What? Well, I got a long day. Please, bust away. Ooh. Bust all away. Chapito, huh? Oh, he doesn't want to trade with me anymore? Well, um, no mind. Okay, I guess. Ooh, to the moon, I guess uh, do not do not worry too much about the trading yet. Too bad we didn't to the moon. bring the manifesto, so you can start radicalizing some workers over here as well. <laughs> There's not even any uh, cops here to stop a peaceful protest. We want to seize the hell out of the, these means. Hey, good news. I have socks. How do you feel about them? I'm sorry, kids, but these stockings are all that's left of our poor mansion. What? Hey, I was just kidding. It's a terrible joke. It wasn't funny. Yes. Why'd you do that? I would never wear these. They have a hole in them. They have a hole in them. Well, in that case, you can wear it as like a mask. And then we get the gun and we rob this place. Take it for all it's worth. I would never wear these. They have a hole in them. That's the only problem. Locked. What the fuck did I just do? 
What do you mean? It's locked. What is locked? What are you doing back there? What is his camera angle? <laughs> Work with Mia, please. No, not Meche. I like the new dress. Well, it's the best I could pull together out here. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get decent fabric and silk stockings on a deserted factory island on the edge of the world? No idea. No, no, I don't. I didn't get any other camera angle in here. This fixed camera angle here is a bit dubious because it seems like there might be something behind her. Like this is not interactable. Children's books. I like to read to the angelitos. It reminds me of better times. I'm so confused. I'm not clicking on children's books here. I'm clicking on whatever she's working on. It's locked. It's locked? The children's books are locked? <laughs> Poor children. <laughs> Why do you do that to them? It's empty. Our type of business doesn't produce a lot of paperwork. I can always make a burners off again. Oh, she's always pulling the thing back now. She's been bitten. One too many times here. Yeah. She still got burn herself now, I don't think. I'm just gonna go in there. Uh, this this room is probably I've got nothing to say to him. Yes, absolutely pointless. Don't worry about it. Unless I can pitch him my cool idea of wearing this as a hat. These calves are way too boxy. Calves are too boxy. Not gonna work. I'm going in there to tell Dom. No, no, that's not the way out. That's what Domino is. That's where you just came from. Do you have a... Uh, mm, mm, uh, maybe that little tiny hammer would have been a nice tool for... Um, oh my god, that's what he wants! I just figured that out. I, I was thinking like maybe Glorious would want it, but no, 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 no. We got a guy who's got a drill that's way too powerful for us. What he wants is something more his size, right? More his speed. Then it can get a drill. Have you ever seen an authentic little chipper? A little chipper? No, I haven't. But I'd sure love to give it a test drive. There you go. Say, little chipper, you're okay. You're okay, little chipper. That's oh, cute. Rusty anchor. <laughs> a good time now. Wait, what else is this? So now I can be in this area here without swimming. Is that interesting? Oh, oh now I'm swimming. <laughs> is that what he calls swimming, Manny? <laughs> what is that? <laughs> Just quickly undulating the. Right, let's let's go see Glorus if he uh, if he would like this drill because I can't actually think of why I would have this drill. No, sorry, the bust all. Need one of these? Uh, that would have been easier to get her open than with my head, but it's too late now. Yeah. Oh, okay. I can just press that and he just does it ahead of himself. So, I need to find some sort of... Oh, God. Uh, some sort of interactable somewhere. Which stands out a little bit, and poke it with my bustle. I can go to the beach. This is this. There's two beaches, right? It's got to be something in one of them. I 
feel like what I need to do here is... I don't know why. But send a bunch of debris down at Glottis. Like, I think, I think I might want to um, go to the claw thing, change it uh, over somewhere where I can grab something, and then move it back here and drop it on the conveyor belt, right? Something like that. This is the only thing I can imagine doing. I don't, I don't know how it's going to help me, but, you know, it's the only thing that's intuitively makes sense to do with this whole setup here. You know? I can extend this thing in a couple of places, but like, it's not doing much. Right? Terrible idea. Do not do that. Do not do that all the way around. I refuse. Is there anything inside the office that I could use the drill with? Now that I have that. The cage? Doubt it. I mean, it's a bust or could I bust them out of the cage? I mean, that kind of makes sense. What is this beach here? It's a really weird area. I love the uh, the computer graphics though on the uh, on the water here. It's really nice. You can really tell it's like a pre-rendered video file just running on repeat. It's great. It looks like water that they've zoomed in on and like uh, and then like they've put it all over the background. <laughs> Something. It's moving so fast. I wonder if it's because my CPU is too fast, so it's like some things are running faster than it's supposed to. Some games can do that, particularly like DOS games. You got like uh, deliberately kind of um, uh, either allocate just one core of your CPU or something, or one thread, so that it doesn't run too fast. Like Deus Ex uh, is a game that doesn't run <laughs> properly unless you do that now, it just runs too fast. It's not a handheld device. I was thinking I could like do that on the beaches somewhere, but there's really nothing to do it on. This beach is kind of desolate. Not much going on here, you know? And it doesn't really go that close as uh, this wall here either. Hang on, I'll, I'll try doing it with my keyboard and mouse controls here. I'll just keep it, keep it controls rather. You can see the edge of the world here. It doesn't want to go far than this. So it's not just like me not finding uh, the proper place to click or anything. It is just uh, that is the edge of the world of the edge of the world. Nope. Yeah. No. There, it's just a totally empty map. I I don't know why, but it is absolutely empty. And I can't go farther than this over here. Can I go in this direction? No. How about here? What's up with this um, grinder here? I don't want to bust all that. I don't want to bust all that. <laughs> oh my god, we're gonna have to get used to him saying he doesn't want to bust all that now, aren't we? <laughs> It 
seems like a dud to take the drill outside. I guess we can take it inside and hope hope to find something. Not much at all going on back there yet. This got hmm. at some point. There's gotta be something I can pinch and then take it over to the other side where I can grind it, right? That that seems to be what what's happening. Cool. Can I bust all the cage of them? Maybe Mechi doesn't know what a gun looks like. This is a menacing object. Could be. Could just tell me it's, it's a gun. Hey, kiddles, check out my bone saw. Oh my! Why are you so horrible? Why are you doing this? With a cry now. Is that helpful? <laughs> it's just menacingly T posing now. I think it I think it overdid it. See it. He doesn't have one. He's such a liar. Oh yeah, well you're stupid. Your light bulbs don't work. Your light Fly, bulbs are be free. No. Go buy ah, nobody Leave thinks you're funny. If we get out again, he'll hurt Meche. Oh yeah, well everybody Fine. in this cage Stay is smarter there. than he you. Is. I see. Oh my god, everyone's just talking over each other. I'm especially smarter than you. In your dreams. In your baby bed that's all wet. Could Last you wet in it? Shut Fine. up! He is mean. That's no, the no, really. I have... Oh my god, god I'm out of love. Holy shit. <laughs> so much noise. So I could open the cage the whole time. They just don't want to. Unless Meche told them to, right? Hey, about that gun. Ready to hand over your heater? I would and I don't have, have a gun. One. Right. Listen, Mechi. Manny, talking. I don't really have a right now, okay? any leads on potential guns either, right? I think the closest I got was the um, guy willing to trade for a gun, saying it, it would cost me. But I don't know if that's like the, just like a throwaway line or something, because I ended up getting the item from him, which was the drill, and the drill so far. Not particularly helpful, right? Maybe I can talk to him now. There's this. Quit yelling. How'd you get a bus stop? I'm connected, plugged in, and I had some booty to trade. Trade's the name of the game out here in the big reef. I want to trade something. Well, you came to the right place, Sonny. What you be needing? Can I trade the bus stop for? A gun. A boat. There you go again with the boats. You know I don't like them. Why do you have to needle me? My friend Gladys to be alive. What? We know he's alive. We've seen him. Over the edge. Oh, stay away from the edge, I tell you. It's dangerous. I've seen whole ships go over it in my time. Their engines in full reverse, trying to drop anchor. But the current, you can't fight her. So stay. I can. <laughs> Boats are just real weak about it. Oh! How about a pair of nice silk stockings? Ah, oh, now there's a high ticket item. I might be able to get you some, but I gotta tell you. Oh no, you I don't want more. I want to give him one. For a gun. Just give me some time to think about it some more. Time? <laughs> That's the one thing I can give you for free. <laughs> well, cool. Okay, I, I, have, I have booty. Let's do some trading. Hey, Jeffy, check out the hosiery. Say, these are real silk. Where'd you find them? I've been wearing them the whole time. You too? Well then, here's your new best friend. 
Ah, my first Brautella gun. Is it loaded? No! Hey, bullets are hard to get. Did I just trade in the stockings for the gun? Just me and little chipper. Yes, okay. We got a gun. Perfect. I thought maybe it would, would be important for me to use the drill already before I could progress. But turns out he just gives you a ton of stuff. <laughs> you just keep asking for more stuff. <laughs> Who knows, maybe this gun isn't the helpful evil. Wait a second, that's a cutscene, right? Something happening? No, no, no. It's just a little transition cutscene. Get it into the zone. There's my gun. Here, what good's a relationship without trust? True, a relationship without trust is about as empty as a gun without bullets. Guess you didn't realize a smart girl always keeps an extra round in her hat for mad days. Come on, let's go. Mitchie, you don't know what you- I know exactly what I'm doing, now move! It seems like a terrible plan, Mitchie. Just my escape plan first. Travel in paradise, kids. You're letting us go right now, or your boy Friday here gets it. Well, I hate to see you go, Manny, but, uh... The lady seems to have made up her mind. I'm serious, I'll shoot him. Fine, he really doesn't work for me anyway. But I thought he... I'll shoot you then. No, you won't. You're too good, remember? I'm not, I'm not good anymore. You've taken that out of me, keeping me up... Sick of being good. Kid's all right. <laughs> She's a firecracker, but a night in the cooler usually dampens her fuse. Okay. Does that mean I can look around this area more than perhaps? It's locked. Nope. That's locked. I can smoke, <laughs> but I can't. It doesn't seem like uh, the work Major's doing was particularly of much interest to us, I guess. Children's books. It's empty. I guess we just go find the ah. That's what Mitch is. That's what cool is. I'm getting angry. Oh no. I'm sorry. I didn't. Is there anybody out there? I guess I I'm didn't enter the angry. right combination. Hugsy. Is there anybody out there? Is a safe included in the all in bust this all? This isn't funny. I don't want to bust all. Money. I don't want to mess up the wheel. The wheel's my friend. Do not want to mess up the hey, lever? I the handle, then I'm never going to get in there. Okay, fair enough. Manny, where are you? Oh no, you're going to make it so annoying to help you if you're going to scream the whole time. I need help uh, busting out Meche. Can you help me? Hello, Mr. Mean Boss Guy. New plan. Meche's locked up for good. We're leaving without her. We can't, can't leave without, without Meche. Meche. You knew what she was going to say. They were going to say. <laughs> oh my god, stop crying. I want to ask you some more questions. It always works and just say, don't cry. Stop crying. <laughs> okay, back to work. So. Okay. You guys are unhelpful. I promise I won't pull guns on anyone anymore. Manny. BB. A safe combination. Let me out! BB! Make us love him. I guess I didn't enter Open the right combination. Door. Guess you did not. <laughs> now where would I find the right combination? Maybe I'll just ask him and he'll just tell me. Because I'm in charge here, right? Domino! Hey, sport. How's the uh, escape going? All right. 
It's time to let Mitch out of the safe. Oh, I usually have to leave her in there overnight for her to really calm down. You think you can break her will just by locking her up overnight? No, but the lack of fresh oxygen slows her down just enough so I can open the door free of fear. Well, I gotta get back to trying to escape. <laughs> yeah, you guys want this, uh, the skeletal lungs, you know? All the new skeletons come from. He seems completely un I've got nothing. Okay, I don't think there was anything particularly helpful about We Are the Sailor. Regarding the safe combination. Unless she it's threw empty. it away in the thing. Nope. It's locked. I'm sorry. Can I talk to you? Must be a Baby. combination lock, but there are no numbers on it. Of course there are no numbers on it. Can I bust in from the side? Open this door! Manny, where are you? This isn't nope. funny! <laughs> it was worth a try. Baby! Can the lid? Oh, can do it. Yep. Maybe? Must have hit a major circuit. Hmm. But it looks like I've exposed the guts here. Uh, okay. That's gonna help me kind of brute force this, right? Okay, I kind of see how that works. Oh, thank God she actually stopped talking after I did that. Holy shit. I'm not entirely sure what I'm doing, but I think it's something like this, right? I guess I didn't enter the right combination. I can't move. I'm not entirely sure how I want this to look. Like, is that open? Is that what open is? I don't know about this. What? Oh, when I had them so nicely lined up and everything. <laughs> okay, they know. They know what I'm trying to do here, yeah. Those by hand. I did have them so nicely lined up and everything. must be made of a harder steel than the outer door. I guess I didn't enter the right combination. I guess I didn't enter the right combination. Is there anything interesting about them when they spin around, maybe? Oh my god. I am so confused. <laughs> Full disclosure. I am extremely confused. This is working like no safe I know. <laughs>
Like, how do I want to orientate them? Is, is there, like, any... Is there any logic here? Is that where I can, like, reason myself to the solution here? Or are we doing a tree puzzle again? Because if it's a tree puzzle again... I don't- I have no idea how I would, like, reason myself to... To the solution here. Because that was... Absolutely insane moon logic. There's no logic in this game. <laughs> God damn. <laughs> I guess I didn't enter the right combination. I couldn't get them out. They're on some sort of heavy shaft. Those are the tumblers of the combination lock. I can't move those by. Mm. Maybe it's that like shaded bit on the side of it that the, all of the bits have. Maybe they, maybe that's a, a thing. like that and then like spin this like that doesn't feel right at all this feels wrong again I'm doing random stuff I guess I didn't enter the right combination it seems kind of important that it like keeps spinning for a long time Maybe some way to hack this if you've done the right, the right combination. Yeah, I, the, there must be like some something else I can do with with these with an item or something. I don't really have many items anymore though. Like I don't know why I would want to use my scythe. Ooh, I hate that sound. Oh, I think I got it. I mess up my blade. Okay. I think I want to line them up. I think I did that correctly. Oh my god! I can hold it! That's why this was such a fucking pain in the ass to do, you can just hold it. No, oh, fuck. Wait, oh no, I didn't do that, fuck. Oh shit. Right. Uh, like that. No, I can't. If I don't get it right, it's really annoying to like it, put it there correctly. If I do it too fast, there we go. Careful, 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 careful. Shit. There we go, and then we keep them in, in place like this, right? Stay. And it stays, and then we can just open it. There we go. Yeah, so there was a reason why he remarked that I did line him up. You can come out now. Mechi? Did she bend the door? Nope. So so sorry. Yeah, I, I just didn't quite understand when it happened that like the problem was that they pushed, uh, they pushed something out. Like you know, when I when I flipped the switch, I thought like maybe I had the right combination, but yeah, they, they, they tried to communicate that something went wrong. Would you on the right track? 
when um when he says I had them lined up. They're all locked up. They're all locked up. Just didn't quite. It was just not quite on the same page as them. Ooh, big axe. Is heavy. I think that's because it. I think that's important because it's heavy. And it looks like there's some sort of pressure thing in the middle here, so. Let's go keep up. Where's Mechi, though? I guess she found a way to escape. Mechi, are you in there? It's time to come out, honey. No time for hide and seek. Man, people in the old days were huge. Doesn't look like he'd enjoy a piggyback ride. Bustle? I think that would just bring the whole ugly thing crashing down on me. Maybe I can bust uh, in some safe. Ha! Bust all my ass. Bust all my ass. I already did that from the other side. Hmm. Can I reach that thing there with my axe or something? Mm, I pick a um, no, safe. No, current makes my marrow tingle. Hmm. Looks like I messed up these contacts when I broke through with the bus stall. Mm, no. They're all locked up. Looks like years and years, of course. They're all locked up. Hmm. I'm confused. What's this axe importance in all of this? This must be the big chipper. <laughs> Why is that helpful? Play around with axe just one more time here, but I don't think I'm achieving much here. Is there like nothing of note in here? Man, people in the old days were huge. Mechi, are you in? It's time to come out, honey. No time for hide and seek. What if I just keep bonking on this armor? Does something happen eventually? Mechi, it's time to come out, honey. No time for hide and seek. And it didn't want to drill it. Because it didn't want to just fall over all over him. No, 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 no. Just drill. Just drill. I think I tried to bust all on everything in the end, then, right? I think that would just bring the whole ugly thing crashing. All these down. deposit boxes? And the door. Beautifully rendered off screen bust though. <laughs> I haven't tried on the axe, I guess. I bust all that. Oh, have you tried just leaving? Be as easy to pick from this side. I already did that from the other side. I don't think it's gonna be as easy to pick from this side. I don't think it's gonna be as easy to pick from this. This must be the big chipper. What's the interactable in here? This is weird. I'm gonna keep dragging the axe along to see if there's like a pressure point anyway, because it's heavy. Like I'll, I'll drag it around this uh, outer edge here. And then the middle, I guess? No, nothing seems to be happening. Maybe we have to put it down before we react to it. <laughs> Maybe I'll do a little blade storm. Nope. 
Not that much. Oh, hang on. Can I interact with things with the axe if I click on them? No. Yes, I can't, like, click on things with the axe. It doesn't, like... They, they don't stop being interactables as soon as I pick up the axe. And I can't put it back on him. I thought you said you didn't want a hernia. What are you giving yourself right now, buddy? Oh no. Is this what it, Looks like what it comes down to? Just scanning the screen for like interactable fake bits of bobs anywhere? This is... Oh no, we're in the pits now. There's just nothing to touch in here. I guess the one thing I haven't done is like rub my scythe against everything. Let's get out, right? I swear I tried that already. I swear Why is that door closed? Uh, it was the only way I, uh, uh, the wind? Oh. We're terrible at this. Hey, this is my room. Go use up the air in your own room. My place. Get out of my place. But I did have to close the door in order to make the contact, didn't I? Is that all the in tickets you got, though? What's in these cases? Take a look. It's all the double-end tickets Hector and Dama stolen over the years. Each one stolen from a good soul, and now they just sit there. That's it. What? They just sit there. That's what's been bothering me. In the days when I was a hot salesman, I used to see double-end tickets all the time, and they move. What do you mean, they move? They become agitated around human souls, and the ticket that belongs to you will actually fly into your hand. But these tickets, and the tickets in that suitcase of Charlie's, it's like they're dead. Why would Hector and Domino be hoarding cases of counterfeit double-end tickets? Oh. Uh -huh. well, that's weird. Doesn't look like she's cooled off yet. Uh, splash. Maybe I should turn this to get some... No shower in here. Oh, okay. What's the deal with this? Warning. Fire system. Do not touch. Not picking that up. Okay, I just need to do some plumbing, so that'll work, I guess, maybe. <gasps> I can't reach that high. Mm. No. Oh, <gasps> yes! I couldn't reach that vent, even if I stood on Mitch's shoulders. Wouldn't it make more sense for me to stand on your shoulders anyway? Are you kidding? Look at your heels. Yeah, she's huge. Or we're very tiny. <laughs> Not picking that up. Yeah, I think we need to flood this place, right? That home plumbing sprinkler system looks like it's about to fall apart. How would I go about doing that? I mean, I have this axe. What does this do? I, I, I can drag it into the new room and see if anything happens. can drag it in here, which seems like it's important. <gasps> Maybe one of these tiles are pressure sensitive. Or not. <laughs> how do you feel about, about what I'm doing right now, Mecho? Are you impressed? This is how I managed to get um, all the way here, you know? With my cool technique. Called the El Maro Shuffle. Ugh. What the fuck, man? I can't reach that high. Not picking that up. That home plumbing sprinkler system looks like it's about to fall. I apart. guess it's time for the scythe again. Oh, fuck. I, I, I bet I can bust um, this. I don't want to bust all that. God, I mean, it doesn't want to. But it could. It could. It really could. But it just doesn't want to. Lazy. There we go. I can break that for the scythe. Uh, or not. Uh, 
Hey Meche, could I borrow your shoes for a second? Your heels? I think it will help me stand on my tippy toes. I don't want to mess up my blade. The 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 um puzzle isn't to um, I don't know, just stand on top of the axe, is it? Because it would get me slightly higher. That thing is definitely not my size. Doesn't look like he'd enjoy a piggyback ride. Wait, is is he reacting differently to the uh, thing now? That thing is definitely not my size. Why would Hector and Domino be hoarding cases of counterfeit double end tickets? Can I get some? Why would Hector and Domino nope. be hoarding cases of counterfeit double end tickets? Why would Hector and Domino oh, be hoarding cases of counterfeit double end tickets? Oh, can I talk to actually? Thanks for not shooting me. Look, I'm sorry. I should have trusted you. It's just that the past two years have been pretty tough, you know? You and me both, buddy. You look like you could use a nice ocean cruise. Still my travel agent, eh? You look like you could use a Still my travel You look like you Still my travel agent, eh? I can't reach that high. Can I make her hold it or something? No. Nope. I am so baffled by this axe, man. What the hell is this axe about? There's gotta be somewhere where I can use this axe. It's gonna change something. <clears throat> but it's so annoying to try doing anything because he's so slow. It just looks like it would be right there, right? right? In the middle here? This must be the big chipper. Yeah, no. Would something change if I left the axe in there? And then I close the door again. Mojo would actually let me even do it. I don't think that would shed any light on things. Thank you. Much appreciated. I don't think it's. I would be <laughs> so confused if I could uh, close this door again. So I, I really appreciated th that they prohibited me from doing that. Definitely not my size. I guess I can try the the bus all on more things in there. I think that would just bring the whole ugly thing crashing down on me. I don't want to bust all that. I don't want to bust all that. What do you want to bust all? I can't reach that high. I don't think this ever actually works on anything, just like pressing the button. I think you always have to be able to click it to actually use this thing with anything. So I don't have to go on like every wall or anything, I don't think. I can't believe I'm about to do this, but I think I'm about to put the axe in the middle of the room so I can stand on it and see if I can reach this. Our relationship has moved beyond that. Our relationship has moved beyond that. Maybe I could make her stand here and when you flip the door it like launches her, you know? They're all locked up. These must be very, very sensitive coral harvest reports. They're all locked up. These must be very, very sensitive coral harvest reports. Bust on Man, my ass. opening this door sold nothing, eh? It just made us even more confusing. <laughs> opening this door really just is the most disappointing thing I've done in this room so far.
I, I thought I was really onto something that we were going to get some momentum, and then they like sucked all the wind out of my sails immediately. Just really pooped my pants. Now, all we have to do is wait for the room to fill up, and we'll just float on out of here. Well, this is disappointing. Not to me. We don't float, remember? What? Why? I don't get it. Because I put the axe in the middle of the room? This must be the big chipper. I... I, I tried spitting that so many times. Warning. Fire system. What? Do not touch. Thank you. Was was it bugged? Oh no. It must have been bugged. Or something. I, I don't know what happened. Why would hit I was trying to turn on the water for so long and it wouldn't do anything. But what? Oh, not again. What? Something's not quite right here. <laughs> Why does, does she seem to think I've turned on the water whenever I use the siphon that? I don't want to bust all that. I already did that from the other side. I don't think it's gonna be as easy to pick from this side. Is it time to get the accent there again? We just need to rust the axe, that's all. Does the water reveal anything? Like, is can I see something in the water that I couldn't see before when it was dry? You know, not that I can see. The wet axe doesn't seem to be much help either. <laughs> it's crazy, but I don't think wet and axe sold anything. It seems to not even made things worse. It's just the same. <laughs> Can I cover the drain with the axe? Oh, not again. Not picking that up. Is that a theme of the water? Water's come to play. Play the theme quickly. I can't reach that high. Man, I really, what the fuck was going on? It, it, it really gets me how many times I spun around that wheel and nothing happened. And it makes me really worried that this puzzle is just broken now and there's something that's meant to happen that hasn't happened. That home plumbing sprinkler system looks like it's about to fall apart. It seems to be more precise about what it did there. Oh my god. <laughs> Because that is right about where the drain is, right? Thank you. Okay, that tile right there. That's where it is. <laughs> Let's try moving that slightly farther ahead as well. Just a bit I give it as good a try as possible. I'm just so blagged by the fact that the water didn't turn on for so long. That it just baffles me. I don't know what happened there. 
Oh. There we go. Nice. After you. What about the suitcases? Forget them. They're counterfeit. They wouldn't fit through this hole anyway. Let's go. Oh, that's what this place is for. I see. I'll meet you back here with the boat. What boat? Well, I'm working on that. Okay, Manny. I have to figure a way to launch that ship Gladys found. What I need is a giant stork to deliver that big baby right here. Okay, how do I go about getting a big old stork? It's the edge of the world, but not the edge I'm looking for. Maybe Glottis is up to something. I feel like Glottis might be doing something different now, right? So I just go and check up on him and see what he's uh, up to. Because um, when we were last there, he didn't seem to be you know, interested in talking or anything, right? That should really save. So maybe he'll just like react different than that to me coming there, you know? Uh -oh. Oh, that's what you do. He grabbed onto the rail there. I, like, I thought he was like swimming around. And I was like, oh my god, you're so strong swimming against the current. It's still strong though. I think this big. Oh yeah, I would. Never mind. He's not changed at all. Meaning I am. Uh, very puzzled here. What we're trying to achieve. He didn't want the, um, the bus doll. I think earlier we were going to try to bust on an object, but it actually didn't. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> I can see myself getting, um, uh, dangerously close to doing something like that. I, feel, I don't think it's supposed to be here yet. I don't think there's anything to bustle down here. I wonder where, where, where that was. But I, I think if you were going to bustle anything now, it would be around... Um, the boat, or, or these conveyor belts, I think. I can't bust all this grinder, can I? And there's not really much here either, on this beach. Because he doesn't want to go. I don't wanna bust off. Yeah, he doesn't want to go to a rock there. There he is! Oh, there we go. Where's the boat? Miss Calamar said- She said you were getting one. Well- Children, be patient. Mr. Calavera's a nice man and he's trying to find us a boat right now, okay? It won't be that long now. I promise. Okay. okay. <laughs> I don't think there's anything to bust all uh, on that beach there. Like, there's nothing on this beach here at all. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I did my, did my due diligence busting <laughs> things on this beach here. There's nothing. There's just sand and, like, things in the background that we can't even reach. That rock, I can't do anything about. I'm pretty sure I tried. Oh, I, oh, I can try looking at it as well. I think it just says that's the edge. I don't want to bust all that. No, this is. Oh, it doesn't want to. Doesn't feel like it. Yeah, I tried to bust all the crane as well. There's got to be something I can grind up, you know.
I guess I can try busting something in the, uh, like around the coral area, you know? Maybe I can get myself a nice coral. I can't go to this other side of this conveyor belt as well, can I? No. This area here. I feel this could be interesting for busting something, right? No, 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 no. Get back. Oh my god. No, that's not it. It's just too close to the screen transition, I, so I can't click it. And every time I go into the screen, I just get, get stuck walking? Hang on, why is he walking still? Jesus. Oh, rusty anchor. Yeah, nah. They covered my bus door, but they cannot have it. Good attitude. Something inside here, maybe? I don't want to bust all that. Nobody there. No drawers. I don't want to bust all that. That's a little bit of overkill considering it's not locked. <laughs> Can I go back in there? I don't want to mess up the wheel. The wheel's my friend. Not right now. I wonder if he wants to go back in there or not. Not right now. Not right now. Yeah, he doesn't want to go back in there. Excellent. That, that's really nice. Oh, can I bust all this bookcase here? It says it's locked. I don't know. I don't want to bust all. Yeah, yeah. That. It says it doesn't matter. Yeah. Nice gun you got, though. Thank you. I've got nothing to say to him. He seems completely unaware of how close I am to escape. That too. Thank you. No, it doesn't like it doesn't like me having stuff in here. That too. Yes. Thank you. Fair enough. Makes sense. He's got his gun. <laughs> it's empty. Not gonna be able to use the bus though when he's got his gun up. His gant. Hmm. Window? No. Yeah, this place seems unhelpful. I rubbed the bustle against basically everything in there. Which means... I don't think I have anything to bust. I busted my last all. Uh-oh. There's nothing here, right? In this screen? Yeah, this screen has nothing. Yeah, I can't even hold my bust all in that screen now. Like, there's gotta be something with this. Like, why can't I do that?
Those things are dangerous. I'd be ground to bits. I don't have the strength to rip them out. Oh my god, it's so far to run! <laughs> Gotta bust all this. There we go. I feel like I tried that. I feel like I was very close to trying that, but I didn't. I can see why they don't give did I press this button instead and like it did nothing? The scoops learned its lesson. I, I swear I tried that before. It's, 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 yeah, I swear I was gonna do that. And, yeah, I, I see what you mean. I, I was gonna do something I didn't try it because I swear I did try to do that. Is there a difference where you click on it? Yep, you did. Yeah, okay, yeah. Because yeah, I did intend to bust, to do the bust all on it, and it just didn't. I was like, oh, I guess it doesn't do anything. I think that seems good. I guess the extra button there is there just to prank you. Yeah, I certainly feel very pranked now, yeah. Because <laughs> I actually did... I, I did figure out what I, what I was supposed to do, and it, I just got betrayed. I think... No, okay. Oh, yeah. That chain was that before. This, that chain has always been there. So what's this other chain up to then that I got now? Whoa, oh, oops. I was re reading the chat. <laughs> I can try turning the chain around and see if that does anything. God, the animations are so long here. It feels horrible. What does this do? Uh, the bunching up now? Why would I want them to bunch up? Oh, that is supposed to be the conveyor belt the whole way. It just... They just fucked up. <laughs> what? Okay, now I've definitely fucked up the grinder, right? Why is he doing that? Wait, oh, wait. I didn't realize there was like another area to put the chain on. Does that happen everywhere? Oh, okay, it does. Oh my god, stop. I, I get it. Yes, I, I get it. Uh, oh, I can rest escape. Thank you. There you go. <laughs> I should probably go and investigate what the deal with the grinder is, though. Can't it, I can't actually touch it. Maybe there's like bits of the grinder down here now. Yes! Maybe if I had some giant steel hair to curl, I don't need the hernia. I can't believe I killed it. <laughs> Can I climb down? 
If we got a chainmail? Perhaps? Yeah, they are already hurting. They do not need the teachings of the Bustal. Why are you doing that voice whenever you got the Bustal on you? Manuel, what, what, what's, what's that voice about? You can't explain? Wanna share with the class what the, <laughs> what the idea behind that voice is? Because I, I have no idea. <laughs> Yeah, I think I'm gonna get the chain back and I'm gonna climb down the and see what's up, right? Uh, psych. There's no chain. What? Okay. Oh no, the, the chain isn't here. It, it's on the. Is it. What? It, how is the chain both summer tennessee on the beach and on the grinder? That's the other thing about this puzzle that I don't understand, is that I was like, how could I- I can't dump, dump anything there. Right? Because the grinder's there, and they dropped a claw there, it doesn't make any sense. Oh my god, I'm stuck. Wait, one? Okay, there we go. Why did I do that? I guess I'm- what? Baffling, absolutely baffling. <laughs> so confused. Let's pull the level. Nothing bad could happen uh, if I do this. Surely something helpful. There goes the chain. But why? Why would I want to do that? There's already a chain to climb up and down. There's no need for that chain. It's all over the old you people and your cushion. Give me some booty and I'll buy our way out of here. I traded it. You traded jewelry and precious coins. Kids. I want where? What? A drink. Ha! Drink. A hug. Mm, that's the one thing I ain't got for you. Tau. Hey. Uh. Think small. Like a knife or a dirty book. You got. Well, I got a long day of reef wrecking ahead of me, so please bust away. <laughs> Why is it still got like dialogue from when they had a bust all? Maybe it's because I didn't exhaust it back then. This musician always kills me when he slowly walks there. This one as well. <laughs> this game seems to think you're way more patient than I am. <laughs> what? What's the deal with this chain? So silly. Absolutely. <laughs> I am I am so puzzled right now. <laughs> oh. You you run into these hitches in this game still where you, you like you're on you know you're pretty good on pretty good terms for most of the game. Things are going pretty alright. And then like <laughs> you get friggin' blindsided by the just the strangest bit of moon logic just now and then and you'd be like, what? What, what, like exactly what am I even trying to do right now? I don't know. I don't want to bust all that. <laughs> like, I don't actually understand what this chain is here for. Like, it feels like the game expects me to have like some sort of revelation. Like my my mind just got like blown the moment I got um, you know the the hook of the chain and I destroyed the um, the grinder. But no. No, that hasn't happened at all. <laughs> My mind is not blown by this. Oh!
That's the anchor. <laughs> My mind got blown. Okay. Maybe things aren't so bad after all. That's the anchor, though. That's the anchor. Okay. Okay. Now, now I get it. Now we're on the same page game. Thank you. Here's what you do. So we first change this around so it goes back up. We're just gonna bunch it up at the bottom, like that, instead of going all the way up. And then we send it back down again. Oh. Let's go. And I don't think we should um, send the chain back up. Instead, I think we go to the crane. No, 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 don't get sucked down. Look how fast it is. Like, this thing is going so fast, and man is like, no, man. Don't worry, dude, I got legs for days. He's got legs for weeks. Oh, that felt good. <laughs> Yeah, come on! Let's go eat some reef! Works like crazy! Full speed ahead! What was the deal with the grinder? Why did it why did it break the grinder? That's a, that's what I don't understand at all. What? Uh. See ya! <laughs> So are you really going to bring me back and try to get your old job again? There's no job for me now except to bring you and everyone else here to the end of the road. But if you aren't going to use me to get your job back, why did you spend all this time trying to find me? Meche, I... I needed to find you. I'm actually not sure what the, the job he gave me was. I thought it would just, you know, sit down the line that I'd give this job. Oh no! Uh, a boss fight! Look, 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 one second, it's gonna go into my inventory. I gotta check exactly what I wanna use. Okay, I, I, I guess I'll use this side here. This one looks perfect. Alright, hold it, and I'm gonna interact. No, I first gotta inspect you. No, oh, no, no, okay. Yeah. Doesn't want to, it like being inspected. This doesn't look good for the kid. Look, Dom, I'm not gonna work for you. Oh, don't worry about that. You're fired. Just consider this your severance. Eyeball? Oh, a I was thinking those grinders look very suspicious. Why aren't you more like me, Manny? I've been trying to show you how, but you don't listen. If you just adopt the proper attitude, just look what could happen to you. Ah! Oof. Well, we weren't lying. We, we did tell them we were going to grind them into bone dust. So we had to. <laughs> Otherwise, I'd be some no good bony guy who just doesn't keep his word. <gasps> oh, that's the year. We did it. Oh my god, it's so bright. Oh, where's my sunglasses? Burn in, I need them. Brilliant, yeah. <laughs> that's one way to put it. <gasps> no, that's more bright. There we go. <laughs> it's like a cigarette. It kind of looks like the entrance to the capital in Elden Ring. <laughs> Bugsy Poligiano, sir. 
Hmm. Waiting room number two. <laughs> Next. Sehr Gottes. Gladys, where'd you go this time? <laughs> These years are all starting to blend in a bit with how to start. <laughs> Gladys. Oh. I could get up there, Manny. Is that a Yushanka you got there? <laughs> Rip Gladys again. <laughs> oh! Bruno? Bruno Martinez? It's been so long! You were the guy who packed me in there. You could have at least given me a magazine. Four years with nothing to read but this damn mug. What are you doing here? And if you were headed this way, why didn't you offer me a lift? Ah, wait, I'm getting out of here. This world's for suckers. <laughs> that guy's got it exactly right. Yeah, that's the, that's the guy we glued in the coffin. Like... A long time ago, yeah, four years ago, in in game time, in the first act in the game. That's no place to put a mug. It's fun to see him again. That's no place to put a mug. What does a mug say? It's the mug I gave Bruno, and it's full of that foam I packed him in. Oh, he's got the foam. It's the mug I gave Bruno, and it's full of that foam I packed him in. I guess what it says isn't important, but I am curious what it says. Hello? Hello? That's the road we came in on. That's the road we came in on. Okay. Nothing down here. No Glorus, just a mug. Let's go up there oh. and see! Hey, where is everybody? Waiting. I started to walk, and I just skipped a bunch of dialogue. Wait in there until they have tickets. They were issued tickets on the number nine, and they don't have them now. The punishment for selling double end tickets is very severe. But they didn't sell their tickets, their tickets were stolen by who Hector Lehman stole them to sell to rich people who don't deserve them. That might be them now. Let's see just what they deserve. <laughs> Oh, uh, it's a lawyer. I guess he had to get out. Okay, I can see maybe why some wouldn't want to take the chance. Going to the next plane of after afterlife with them. It looks a little ungainly, but I bet that hat is really warm. One second, it's got really dark here. I just realized I'm going to turn the lights on. Bear back. Wow. It was so, it was so bright earlier that I had the blind saw it. Like most of this shit, but come nighttime, it just something like it's really dark, and then the ring light isn't quite enough. What happened to that train? Your destiny cannot be purchased. I don't understand. Why has everyone been detained? Given a ticket, a soul may not sell it. Oh, so that that whole scheme they've been trying to do is just not actually helping anyone at all, is it? They didn't sell their tickets, someone else is trying to. Bring the tickets, that is all. The tickets are in Almaro. How can I get there quickly? These rails are already there. Well, thanks for the help. The gate opens. The gate closes. It does not help. Was it you that made that switch point straight down? The living train does what it does. I get the feeling that operating that switch is out of my powers. Not picking that up. Hmm. Recently, I was visited by a bird with a human oh. head. 
Do you know such a bird? I do. That's how I do. No. How do you know my? He knew you, and for you, he left this note. Another mug. I know what you're up to. I've been watching. Stay there. I'm coming to sprout you myself. Yours truly, Hector Lamans. Híjole. That's not Salvador. Well, someone's com coming to see me at least. That's not much good news. Yeah, there's no one else. Oh, how did you get here? Because they hitched the ride. Hey. How'd you get free? I was born free, Boatnik. Nobody gave Boatnik. me no ticket, so nobody can take it away. So what are you pacing around here for? Trying to unwind a little bit. All those years circling in one direction. Gotta even out my life in this world before I go on to the next, you know? Well, that ought to do her. Goodbye, Chapito. Happy trails, Captain. And thanks for setting me straight back there in the drink. No problem, this buddy. This light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Hide it under some seaweed. No, I'm gonna let it shine. There he goes. Hey, maybe everyone should just walk uh, down the train tracks. I could walk out of this world right now and not look back, but I can't. I can't do it. I'm not leaving without the people I promised to save. Okay, so I, I guess the problem isn't like going into the next plane of the afterlife. Problem is just how you get to the station. <laughs> they would be fine if just, you know, walked here. They'd be okay. No, they cheated their way in by selling the train tickets. Bastards. <laughs> This really sounds like Ralph the dog. I'm not sure who Ralph the dog is. <gasps> demons! Gladys! Hear the name of the great one. Hey, Miko Demons! What's happening? How many days has this grand demon gone without driving? Well, we've been hiking for months. Months? Months? Oh, then the noble one will surely die. But. Oh yeah, the, he did say at some point that he literally has to like drive or like work on cars or he dies, right? I guess, and he thought they were, they were like lying when they figured out he would be, you know, he didn't die immediately, but I guess they didn't lie, like, it was half-truth, I guess. Gondolas? I knew we should have checked this side of the mountain before we walked up. <laughs> Gladys, I'm sorry. Manny. Why didn't you tell me you were sick? Couldn't stop. Have to save everyone. Are you in much pain, my friend? Only because I let you down, Manny. What can I get you? Will anything help? I need to A real? race to fly like, like the old days, Manny. In the bone wagon. But the bone wagon's not here, carnal. Maybe I'll see her on the other side. Can't we make a new hot rod? Those days are done, Manny. <sighs> no more hot rod. Hey, what's that red thing? The gondola? Mm, sweet decal work. Listen, fellas, somebody, somebody get a pen. Oh, thank you. There it is. No need to solve the, the gondola puzzle. Save me if you have the right... <coughs> the right... <coughs> fuel. What fuel, Gladys? Gladys. You gotta get some G fuel. The short for Gladys fuel. If you, if you didn't realize G Fuel could get any worse, I, I think they're selling NFTs now of G Fuel. <laughs> Dude. Video games were a mistake, I think. What's wrong with him? Do you not know the one purpose, the one skill, the one desire of this humble spirit? Yes, but we Oh god, yeah. <laughs> why? Why are you here? 
Whatever. Motherfuckers. I, uh, I got him fired and then, uh, Some people just never know when enough is enough. <laughs> what am I done to? Can you cure him? His spirit has fallen so low, normal driving would not cure him in time. He needs They even took the most noblest among us. G fuel. <laughs> Do you have any vehicles here that we could use to revive him? Only the trucks that deliver the souls. But they are slow. So slow. Who are you guys? We are mechanics. Save Aji. But we have never before seen one of our kind so, so large. I'm gonna go see what I can do. so huge. Quickly, for his time here is not long. Hmm. Is that a tiny coat rack? Oh. I hate it when people leave their crusty mugs out in the break room. But you just did that. You just left the, the, the crusty Erst mug in the break room. I've never seen a, like a mug thing like this. Is this a thing that exists? Is this real? Hey, my mug's on the rack. I feel like an honorary employee. Your mother doesn't work here. Since nobody listened to my last warning about keeping this refrigerator clean, I'm afraid I'm gonna have to lock it until some of you grow up. Signed, the facilities department. That's very relatable. Can I open it up? Oh, it's locked. But I <laughs> don't think I've ever worked anywhere that hasn't had a sign like that. <laughs> People love the your mother doesn't work here line. Is that everyone's favorite? Oh, the drawer. Full of rags. I'll take a rag. It was a good idea to have a clean rag around. Can I do my dishes? I'm not in the mood to dust. Never mind. I figured I'd try. You know. Maybe there was a sort of cleaning base puzzle to say I had this whole time, and I would have just neglected it because I was lazy. You know. Don't want to be dirty. A little dirty boy. Lock up their tools just like Gladys. Who does that? We have how your mother doesn't clean their side of workshop too. <laughs> it's everywhere. You can't stop these guys from making these signs. They lock up their tools just like Gladys. <laughs> Not paid to move those. No, stop. Alright, all of this is the same interactable. Gotcha. How eerie. They lock up their tools just like Gladys. What's up with it? Sadly, I have no mug to hang. I'm gonna take the mug back. Why did they do that? Does it help me at all putting my mug here? Why did they do that? I hate it when people leave their crusty mugs out in the break room. Why do you say that when you do that? Are, are you telling me I need to do the dishes before I hang it up? What? I don't. I don't. I don't get you, Manny. I don't get you. <laughs> Being very cryptic. I don't quite really understand where I can go up he from here. Can I go down here? Oh, it's so bright. Oh, fuck me. That's the road we came in on. Nothing out there but snow and a perfectly good pair of sunglasses. Well, would you like to take up the sunglasses, perhaps? <laughs> what is our puzzle? I don't know what my, I don't know what my puzzle actually is right now. Like, what am I trying to do? That's no place to put a mug. Oh, put the mug away then. It looks like blueprints for a. Rocket sled, they're brilliant. It looks like blueprints for a rocket sled. They're brilliant. Meche, we have to get back to Omaro for the tickets. Oh, Gladys. Hey, how about a gondola ride, Gremlins? He's too big. The gondola is too slow. Gotcha. I feel like the only place I have anything I could, like... 
have agency over right now is the <laughs> break room kitchen. Unless there's something in the station? There might be something in, the, in like inside here. Like the door? No, that's where I came in, shall we? Yes. I'm Bye. With the people I promised to save. Yeah, station is basically empty. Whoa, 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 whoa! What's up with this angle here? Well, it's not that I'm afraid or anything, but there are easier ways into the station, and I'm not walking back to El Maro. Can we talk to him about going back to El Maro? My friend is sick. Can you help us? A thousand demons have died upon delivering the souls they were created to protect. Well, thanks for the help. The gate opens. The gate closes. It does not help. I get the feeling that operating that switch is out of my powers. Is it outside the powers of... What the fuck is that? It's a lovely rag. Oh, the rag. It's the mug I gave Bruno and it's full of that foam I packed him in. That's no place to put a mug. <laughs> I'm at the stage now, for sure, where I'm just gonna be rubbing all my items against all the dudes. I'm not in the mood to dust. Because I can't think of anything that makes sense. To dust. Can I goop up the um, the rails? Maybe would that make a difference? That's no place to put a mug. Goop goop. Mm. No, yeah. There's, fr there's three areas. It's up there. It's down here, and it's with the uh, and it's down here. And this place. I think I got everything I need from this place, right? I already got a mug full of that stuff. Hello? Whew. They're empty. Locked. Probably to keep out the Yeti. Locked. Not picking that up. Yep. As far as I can tell, nothing down here. Unless I can use my rag on anything? I guess I guess I may as well I'm down here. Rub the um the rag on the the cards and the coffin down here. It really gets me that he wants to put the mug on the um, rack though. Dust. Like he does that without even like consulting me. He just does it. Like what's I'm the deal of that? To dust. Why would he want to do that? I tried cleaning it as well, and it's just like nah. I don't, I'm not in the mood to dust. Like, look, I, I didn't even have to mug in my inventory, and he just does it. I hate it when people leave their crusty mugs out in the break room. Then why'd you do it? I already have a rag I don't know what to do with. Yeah, <laughs> I have no idea what to do with this fucking rag. <laughs> I know what you're up to. I've been watching. Stay there. I'm yours truly, Hector Le Mans. I could show the threat to people, I guess. I think that would only raise the alarm level here. I think that would only raise the alarm level. Okay, could I show it to the guy in the gate? Be like, yo, someone's trying to kill me. Can I get some help? I think this is something I should keep to myself. Okay. Let's see how far that gets you in life, Manny. I think this is something I should keep to myself. Did Gloria say something like, the only thing I need is? Thing? What fuel? Oh, fuel, that's it. I've got to go see what I can do. Come for it. Fuel. Blood it. What? What fuel? What's actually even interactable in this screen? Your mother does. I'm afraid I'm going to have to lock. <laughs> Ha! <laughs> 
Your mother I'm afraid I'm Can't take the note. <laughs> if I took the note, that would make me the mother, and I refuse. But then what would the little mechanics toast their tiny English muffins in? There's a note next to this toaster. To avoid further mishaps, please butter your English muffins after you toast them. Facilities. Do I have like a fork or something I put in the toaster? Why? Mm, happiness is a warm rag. I'm not in the mood to dust. Is this a different rag now? It's a lovely rag. What was that? Can I keep doing it? I don't think the rag is different. Happiness is a warm rag. What? I'm not in the mood to dust. Can I give him a warm rag, perhaps? Here, blot his forehead with this. He needs to fly, not to be dry. Sorry. He doesn't need that right now. Did I show them a mug already? Was that a Beatles reference? Probably. It seems like the kind of reference they would I have. No mug to hand. have. I'm, I'm actually like surprisingly unfamiliar with the Beatles, so I wouldn't be able to tell you. Gladys, wake up and look at this. Is this fuel? Gladys, wake up and look at this. That's no place to put a mug. Would someone like to look at my mug, please? That's no place to put a mug. Gladys, no, wake guess up and look at this. I'm getting very little done here. I hate it when people leave their crusty mugs out in the break room. Happiness is a warm gun. Oh, that's a thing. That, yeah, I know what you're talking about now, yes. I think this is something I should keep to myself. <laughs> you wouldn't want to share this sensitive information with a toaster. I wouldn't want to upset a toaster. I'm not in the mood to dust. I'm well, what in are you in the mood to, to do then? You don't seem to be mood to do anything here around here anymore. <laughs> you're just in the mood to put you putting your freaking uh, paper in the. Uh, in the toaster? Why? <laughs> a rag rather. Mm, happiness is a warm rag. Why are you putting the rag in the toaster? And I did I did tell them to. Maybe I'll do some dusting later. No you won't! You keep telling everyone you're not in the This better not stay in my pocket. What? Is that? How was I meant to see that? <laughs> fuel! I invented fuel! I knew it was gonna be fuel. Something that powerful could fuel a, a rocket. rocket. If only we had more. Well, I could score you a couple of truckloads if you're interested. We shoot you now like an arrow into the wind. May you pierce the heart of the wind itself and drink the blood of flight. Speed is the food of the great glasses. Speed bring you life. Come back to us someday. <laughs> If only that bit of oil that was a little bit more visible. <laughs> <laughs>
It was just like a tiny thing on top of the barrels, and I, I really didn't think that was gonna do anything. You sure this thing's going to hold together? Uh, at least most of the way. Hey, look! We're all ready to Rubacaba! Manny? Manny? Manny, where are you? Manny, I'm frightened! <laughs> Oh no, he's breaking the piggy! <laughs> he got fucking yeeted. Oh my god, is this Rubikawa again? Holy shit. I didn't think we were gonna be back here. Are we getting fish out of the drink? No, we're not. Captain's not here. Ah, Rubikawa! What a town! Remember the glory days, Manny? Long gone, my friend. There's nothing here for us now. Except maybe our old car. He did say it's here. Dios mio. She oh my god, movie. that's why. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> Was it Domino perhaps? Is that why there's so many Dominoes in here? <laughs> Back in your world, there was a mention of packing foam and fire extinguishers not mixing well. Yeah, I did figure that they could be fuel. That's why I kept trying to rub the the mug on them. I'm like, check it out, I got fuel. Probably, most likely. <laughs> but they wouldn't they wouldn't hear, hear me out. I'm not setting foot down there. The slightest bump could start those dominoes tumbling. I'm not setting foot down there. The slightest bump could start those dominoes tumbling. Don't panic. Yeah! I'm not setting foot down there. The slightest bump could start those dominoes tumbling. How is this scythe gonna help me? I don't want to mess up my blade. Wait, what is even interactable on the screen right now? Mess up my blade. Hmm. Doesn't want to mess up his blade. Manny Calavera will do anything for love, but he will not mess up his blade. I'm not setting foot down. There. It, and he wants that foot to the run the domino zero. Looks like Domino left his calling. <laughs> That's a very elaborate calling card. He must have done this on his last trip through town. <laughs> he, he did look very bored. He did look extremely bored. So it does look like something he, he would do. <clears throat> oh, time to go look at my revolutionary friends in here. They're gone. I wonder if um, Olivia ever managed to clean up the room. Nope, it's it's a uh, quarantine now. They got way too freaky in them, I would, too fast. But I hate sucking gelatin straight from the tap. I don't need the hernia. Coffin shooter one, two, three, just pour, chill, and serve. Not here. What? Why not? No room for that. Okay, I can't. I can't believe we're back in Rubicaba, dude. Calif oh hey, there she is. Doing here? I heard you went pow in Zapato, Daddy. Well, Hector Lamont's tried and missed. Now it's my turn. I'm headed to El Maro to put him out of business. Manny, that place has changed. You don't know what you're getting into. I'd better come with you. Just give me a minute to get ready. Okay, but if you hear a loud explosion anytime soon, the trip's off. Coffin shoot. I would, but I hate sucking gelatin straight from the tap. Okay. I'm supposed to wait for it? Probably not. That'd be ridiculous. Knock. Bonk. You're being slow. I think she's literally waiting for me to figure out what to do with this keg <laughs> until she leaves. I don't need the hernia. Alright. Let's get out of hell out of here. I need some tools to um, open the keg. Maybe I can get another box opener if I go back to the um, the racetrack today. It 
always found out that they had like a little bit about the, the, the little bit of trivia we had about the, the foam and they came back uh, a few years later, oh, well, a few acts later I guess. It's not been years, but you know what I mean. Like a few parts later in, in the game, it comes back, it's fun. Oh, we could check on the lighthouse. That could have something. Oh, no, I don't think... Uh... Oh, no, I'm at the top here, okay. Oh, Lola. Oh, Lola. I guess you'll never be going back home to Lola at this rate. Nothing here. Not even bees. I was kind of curious if to be up to something. I guess this is a ghost town. Uh, it's locked. No. Oh, we can't even go up there. Right, so the level is just much, much, much smaller now. Done. If they have the bridge, though, we can still get to the race tracks. Oh, we can also get to the docks from here. If the captain's here, he is. Manuel Calavera? <laughs> well, what happened to the limbo? Hate to tell you, Velasco, but she went down at the Pearl. But we found a new ship, the SS La Mancha, and managed to... The La Mancha? Uh, my old rusty bucket. Where is she? Oh, well, we traded her in Puerto Zapato for a team of sled dogs. That does it. I'm out of this stinking mob town. But thanks for finding my baby, Manny. Puerto Zapato, here I come. Mob down. You, you, you didn't ever realize you were here for a year dealing with the mob. You kind of was the mob, and you never realized. Oh no! Bottle chip. You finished it? Maybe. Maybe I'll just finish this for him. You'd think after two years he'd have the little SS Lumbago's lifeboats on at least. Wow, roasted. Maybe he'd have his boat still if it wasn't so terrible at making little tiny boats and bottles. <laughs> Unbelievable. I don't really want to do that. I'd drink it, but I'd probably get the SS Lumbago stuck in my throat. I figured. It's gotten pretty lax around here, apparently. Yep. Can I go up here now, though? He did say it wasn't like gonna be part of the game, basically, last time. It's locked. That goes to the upper dock, but nothing's docked there now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Same, same shit. How about, uh, Toto? Was that name Tito? Surprisingly, the blimp's still here. Oh my god, I thought we had climbed into this tattoo parlor for the last time. I can't believe I have to see this animation one more time, man. <laughs> Fuck me. It does not bring back a good memory seeing this again. Oh my god, Manny, get a move on, please. <laughs> How is it still so noisy in here? I don't want to wake up Toto. Not my fault! Oh, uh, he's the one sleeping now. Toto's plum tuckered out. No, I don't want to disturb his grumpy little dreams. I Your don't want to wake will up Toto. Love it. Toto's plum tuck. No, I don't want to disturb his grumpy little dreams. Fuck. Huh? Hello, operator? Yeah, it's me, man. Your mother I was just will passing love through it. town and. <laughs> Wow, still mad. It's been so long too. Not picking that up. I wonder if Inez has cooled off yet. I kill you. Nope. Why, why am I even in here then? I don't want to wake up Toto. Quit whining. Man, that, that's uh, snoring is the most egregious thing I ever heard. I don't want to disturb his grumpy little dreams. Oh, Toto's plum. Yeah, I don't think there's anything interactable down here. Why am I, why am I down here? 
I don't wake up not picking that one over. What's the puzzle here? The Toto is sleeping? This is a simple way to solve this. Just wake him up and then you can do whatever you like. <laughs> I am I am what? an artist. You know, a simple honk shoe would have done it. <clears throat> Maybe a me 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 me. There can't be too much in here. I'd better save it. What is that? Liquid nitrogen, not to be used on bone. Liquid nitrogen. Why do I want that? I guess I can use it on the barrel? Try to crack that open? We get a gelatin? I don't know why I want a gelatin. Is it actually gelatin or is that slang? Yeah. No. I was thinking for a moment I could like mix my items together, but that's like not how this game works at all. There's like a very sp explicit rule that like, you don't have to think about how the items inter interact with each other because you can't rub them. Uh, together or anything. Just have to think about uh, uh, how my items work with things in the world. There can't be too much in here. I'd better save it. Okay. Not to sound like a capitalist oppressor, but I have people who do that for me now. That's not even true anymore, Manny. You don't have any employees. What are you talking about? <laughs> you don't have a business. You can't just reuse that line and uh, you're after. It doesn't make sense anymore. <laughs> Manny. Oh yeah, the microphone. I just can't do it without an audience. Never mind. I just can't do it without an audience. You'd think after two years, he'd have the little SS Lumbago's lifeboats on, at least. What? It's locked. I don't think that lock is meant to be open, right? I think it's just meant to restrict me away from going to the upper area. I'm going to try not to worry too much about that. I've put his stomach through enough for a while. There can't be too much in here. I'd better save it. What the hell are my items for? Little ball boat? And some nitrogen. What's that? Ship in a bottle. Nice. Oh, God damn it, Gladys, he got me hopeful for a second. I don't really want to do that. I don't really want to do that. It would just evaporate. I don't actually know what's left to touch. The lighthouse, I think, is just there for payphones, right? I don't think there's anything useful there. I think it's just to um, remind you of the time you went there and you saw Lola get killed there. I think that's j the only reason the lighthouse is there. I don't think I need to, to do anything there, right? But there's very few places I can be right now. It's really not many interactables, you know, so I, I don't, I don't know where to go. Yeah, the light has this big old nothing in it here. At least that I can see, yeah. No, 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 don't go in there. Don't go in there. I wanted to go around. There we go. 
Nope. <laughs> well, I got to make a nice circle around the lighthouse at least. <laughs> I love this puzzle, it's such a peak point-and-click logic. What are you even talking about? What puzzle? There's no puzzle! <laughs> this puzzle is so peak point-and-click logic that it's not even a puzzle. There's... Hello, oh. Terry? Oh, I see. This whole puzzle situation, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what I'm trying to do. I just have like trash. I'm just I just carrying trash around town. <laughs> I drink it, but I probably get the SS lumbago stuck in my throat. What is this barrel? That's what the lumbago diorama needed. Fake ocean water. What? I don't really want to do that. <sighs> I, I, well, I guess the, the boat in it wasn't the important part. drink it, but I'd probably get the SS Lumbago stuck in my throat. Okay. Oh my god, is- is my- is my- am I gonna like wake up Toto now with the water? Do you want just drink? What's that? It's uh, Lumbago lemonade. Try it. Mmm. Perkly little aperitif actually. <laughs> Yes, siree. Not bad at all. Tell me where you got that right now! Olivia's kitchen. Lumbago lemonade! Manny, aren't we in a hurry? Don't worry. This won't take long. My stomach don't stretch like it used to. Oh, Gladys. Okay. Now we what? should get back in case it blows. So I don't have the bottle anymore, right? Excellent. You love to see it. So what is that stuff they pack can hams in anyway? Wouldn't this make it worse for me? I feel like this would knock over all the dominoes. Good show, my friend. You wouldn't happen to have a breath mint on you, I suppose. What? Oh, because it was a bunch of jelly. <laughs> sure. The gelatin is still liquefied. It wouldn't stop the dominoes from falling. <laughs> Good thing I have this nitrogen. <laughs> You're fucking kidding me. Hey, good idea. This is absolute right, nonsense. Oh, <laughs> this is so dumb. <laughs> I'd better disarm her first. Yeah, sure. Then it the um cipher darts or can you just do it by hand? Here goes nothing. Oh. Looks like Hector's taking over the whole town. He sure looks like it, yeah. Resistance. There's only one small group who oppose him, and they live out on the fringes of the city. Oh, found him. How oh, come on, you know me? I hope they're not hurting Gladys. Huh. Shows what you know about this group. 
Their leader is a great man who... Manuel Calavera, we meet again. I see you have found what you were looking for. I'm fortunate for you to arrive now just as we too are about to achieve success. Our army has grown, and right now our top agents are in Hector's weapons lab, about to close in on the enemy in his own den. I couldn't have done it without you, Manuel. It was a trap! Stand back. There's only one thing to do. <gasps> Thank you, sir! You have saved me! But more than that, you have enabled me to continue to serve the movement! What did you say about a trap? Hector uncovered our agent in his weapons lab. No. If only I had an axe, I could have saved a few more people. Does he look a bit different? He looks chunky on it all. Is that Charlie? No. What? No time to explain. Now I'll have to take matters into my own hands. Take me with you. I've longed to be of service to your cause for years. Who was that? Also, I don't know if I trust Olivia that much. <laughs> I don't know, it's just, she seems like one sassy backer. I bet the agent in this photo is the poor guy that Hector just shot. I bet the agent in this photo is the poor guy that Hector just shot. I bet the agent in this photo is the poor guy that Hector just shot. Fair tons of charm. Now I get it. I bet that guy was a poor guy that Hector just shot. <laughs> hey, how you doing? My old co-worker. Any messages for me? No, nope. call stopped coming for you the day you left. They're still sending you that lingerie catalog though. Hmm, good service. They know exactly what I need. Lingerie. Calling all cars. Calling all cars. You never know when you could need okay? more underwear. Uh, the, just testing the equipment, sir. Salvador, maybe you should shut that thing off so we can talk. Salvador, come in. Salvador? Memo. To all agents, priority urgent. In light of the recent disappearances, all agents better save this part from sprouting. What was that? Oh, the hand. No, it might Never know when you might need one of those. <laughs> yeah, it might come in handy. You, sir. Ah, beat me to it. The rest of him has gone to seed already. Hector, I almost have that new bouquet of tulips ready for you. Listen to me once and for all, Bowsley. You are not a florist! You are a manufacturer of weapons! But I... Who's the plant nut? That nut is Hector Lamont's personal munitions expert, Bowsley, a.k.a. The florist. That was his job in the old world, but here he is a botanical weapons expert. This has left him fairly conflicted. Why does he make Sproutella for Hector instead of our side? We've been trying to recruit him for years, but his lab is in Hector's tower. He's untouchable. Hmm. I see. This camera's showing nothing but flowers. Must be another fallen agent. Bet if I could get that plant lover out of there, I could talk him into making a gun for me instead. This camera sprouted as well. That's three LSA casualties in one night. Come here. I thought man. they were so close. <laughs> hey. Must be a little Mitchy. Salvador, come in. Salvador? Okay, here's the plan. I need a disguise so I can get close to Hector. And a gun, so we'll have something to talk about. Oh my god, there. this is more like it. Now I can know what I'm looking for. <laughs> His casino tower is directly above these headquarters. Alright, uh -huh. meet me there. 
Volunteers quickly for dangerous work. She could be very useful to the cause. As far as I'm concerned, she is the cause. Thank you. This is this is uh, going to be a little bit easier, hopefully, than the last part. Even though it was very short. That, like, um, Anthony part was very short, but I just had no idea what I was doing. <laughs> so, I was very confused. And this part looks different. I don't remember this part here being here at all. How about this one? Anyone down here? Can anyone hear me besides the scary monster? I'm gonna quickly save just to see what my progress is. Because I'm, I'm going long. I can't even go longer if... Uh, but I'm not in a rush to end the stream, so if I'm like... We've been finishing the game. I could do that tonight. I don't think there's enough uh, game left now for, for another full stream. Yeah, I think if we could finish this tonight, that would be best, right? Because I feel like we're um, within reach now, arm's reach of the end. Oh no, I'm gonna have to find another short game to play! <laughs> God damn it! <laughs> I have finished this game too soon. <laughs> oh, I've got to out some way to disguise this pretty face before I hit the streets. Might take an hour or more still. Hmm. Not sure. Yeah, not I think like Johnny Thunder lets just anybody. Hang on, but he's familiar. No, I mean, being allowed to wear the Johnny Thunder makeup is an honor. Yes, a privilege. Yes. So I said to her, "You give me that ten percent discount, or I'm taking my business elsewhere." You said that? Well, oh yes, I was mad, you know. And then here's the. This guy's kind of remind me of the cannibals in uh, Monkey Island. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I don't mind going for another hour to to finish this. If, if that's, it doesn't go too late to anything. Oh, are you here for the fun? Don't want to keep uh, uh, other people up all night. <laughs> yes, I am. Oh, oh I found the disguise at least. I just need to be painted. He just got the last two parts. Maybe next season. We've been an hour. Okay. As as I Perfect. Up enough money for what? You can't just buy a double N. Well, I know somebody who knows somebody who knows uh, Hector Lamont. Wow, you know everybody. <laughs> no autographs. So then I says, "Well, oh, coffee. Mm. Show business coffee. How about I pour it on them and then have to do the makeup again? Coffee, great." About time we got a PA around here. Hey, kid, keep it black, and keep it coming, all right? Really? And the director's okay, I can pour him coffee. I don't exactly see how that's helpful. Oh, ladder. Well, I guess so. Ah! Oh! oh, what did you do that for? I didn't. I. You melted my makeup. I can't go on like this. I took you under my wing, and this is how you pay me back. No, no, it's not like that. There you go. This coffee's already ground. Perfect. I think that means I can go in here now. Hey, kid, put that coffee away. This is your lucky day. We got no... Ooh, I've got the disguise already. Under review. Yes, I've been working for this moment all my life. Then sit on down. We got to start your makeup. Perfect. Now don't go too far. You never know what time is showtime around here. Yeah, I guess that's why you're just hanging uh, around uh, outside. Well, I don't think I have to do anything around here. Then. I think all I wanted was the makeup. <laughs> do I need... Uh, any other parts? That's my disguise here. I'm good to go. Good to go. That's all I needed. Didn't even need another jacket.
I was gonna be so upset if that washed away his makeup though. I can't remember the last time I had access to a men's room. This is uh, what they've done to um, the travel agency, isn't it? Yes, it is. Yeah, because that's the janitor. Going up. This elevator goes up straight to the penthouse suite of Hector Lamange. Mr. Lamange, he only do the business with the very select elite clientele. Good. Cool. But can't you tell I'm the most elite of them? I got a nice nice flag from a fictional country on my face right now. Is that uh, Chow Chilla Charlie though? Hey, what's going on under that raincoat? I don't know what's going on under that makeup. Agent Calavera, you? Oh, it's the hand guy. Have this evening? Yes, which has given me this glorious opportunity to serve the cause by gathering funds for the LSA while stealing from our arch enemy at the same time. <laughs> what exactly are you doing with these slot machines? I stick myself inside like a finger down the throat of Hector Limons himself, and I make the machine regurgitate the wealth it has devoured. Yeah. That doesn't seem like a great plan, but you do you, buddy. Buenos dias. Back off, sleazeball, or my husband here will bust your jaw. Hola. No? I can't walk. <gasps> That's Charlie. Thanks. There he is. I did... I, I, I was right that uh, he was here. I just uh, didn't... Uh, Hey, Guess which one? Money. Maybe Hector's not all that bad. Hey! Oh, you're kidding me! It only pays off if you bet. That's not fair. Oh, I see. So, if you don't have any money and play, you always win, don't you? But if you actually like bet, then you probably just lose. Yep. Hey! I guess I could return the hand to him. Oh, he's doing something. No, 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 put that away, put that away. Can you crack? What is he doing? None of these unholy temples is safe from the LSA. Mira! No. I wonder if I can, like, make him just, like, do something to him. If I start playing the machine he's currently inside of, you know? I think that would be disrespectful. I thought it was being helpful, not disrespectful. I mean, maybe you can, like, put the hand back. I don't know. Oh, I still got the nitrogen. Okay. Uh, that's a picture of yourself, buddy. I think it's yourself, that's anyway. no way to treat an agent of the LSA. No, okay, so no items. Oh, I, I can't actually pull the lever. Because, uh, see, this one has these symbols on it. But these just can't as him. Like, I guess these uh, stop machines say are just part of his model, or at least oh, it just has like a big old click box here, you know. Ignore that. <laughs> the king goes through the now. It's not gorilla time yet. <laughs> it's very rare that I actually use the, uh, the cursor keys, so usually I don't have the opportunity to accidentally press my uh, my, my scene uh, transitions, trans uh, transition keys. Suddenly, gorilla! That's how they get you. So if, if you were spooked by Gorilla just now, that's it. You wouldn't have made it in the jungle <laughs> with the mighty Gorilla around. They would have got you. <laughs> you weren't prepared, were you? Well, well, well. Don't you feel lucky you're at the comfort of a computer right now? <laughs> that's no way to treat an agent of the LSA. What exactly am I trying to do here? I think that would be disrespectful. Can I do the same thing as him? Because I got the hand, can I like 
feed the hand in it. No, everything with this hand is disrespectful, but not looting the hand. That was not disrespectful, so you could do it, but <laughs> everything else with it, do not do it. That's no way to treat an agent of the LSA. What the hell am I trying to do? Hola. Is it because he doesn't recognize me? No drinks for me, thanks. Can you crack any machine? Oh my god, I gotta wait so long for any sort of interaction. None of these unholy okay. Okay, so every time I say that, he says, look, and he goes into the machine. Is that when I like, can like interact with it at all? No, no, they... I think that would be disrespectful. I think that would be disrespectful. I don't know what the puzzle is. And I can't go through um, yeah, but can I? Yeah. I can't go strolling through the halls now. I'm on the lamb. Then what the hell am I trying to do? I'm select and I'm very elite. You look like you whoa, 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 what was that? To me, pal. These aren't my regular clothes. Well, when you get your regular clothes, I'll give you the regular treatment. I saw that. Out of my way. I'm in show business. That show. You can follies? <laughs> Look, I just Ten. want you to understand that I'm totally sympathetic to the extremely intense power trip you're on. But beat it, or should I say, mush? <laughs> hey, weren't you once a tube switch you repairman? Yeah, but they took out the whole tube system. It kept getting jammed. Not my fault. Now, finally, I am free to pursue my one true desire. Elevator operation? Yes. Ten of eight. Johnny Thunder isn't going to be happy about this. Maybe Mr. Thunder needs to spend more money on wardrobe. Johnny Thunder isn't going to... Maybe Mr. Th Maybe Mr. Thunder needs to... I think this is his good side. Oh, I can see the numbers here as so well. It wasn't the, the, that angle wasn't like important for anything. Never mind. Never mind. I thought I'd stumble onto something. Hmm. I'm okay for now. Oh my god! They all let me live here. Fuck. Okay, so. Um, I do have more places I can solve things than just the casino done. Mm. I was hoping it was just the casino, because um, that would limit the scope of where I won't need to solve stuff. But now I need to be like all over the place. It's a bit more complicated. How about this one? Anyone down here? Mm. Monsters? Again, go to sleep, sewer thing. Close your big clay blind eyes. There can't be too much in here. Oh, that's a thing. Think? Okay, I don't know what's down there, but I have issues with it. Okay. Okay, it's too spooky to go over there. So I guess, go guess don't wanna go there. Maybe near the light. I said this before. In this area, I don't think there was much I could do. I don't know what hand and everything gets me. Oh, the pigeon. That's gotta be important or something, right? 
I show him this photo, he'll fly off without anything to deliver. Yeah, 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 yeah. They did specifically say that if you have a photo of someone, you, it'll deliver to them, right? So do you want to like deliver the hand or something to them? Would you like a bone, little guy? Ow! Not one of mine. Oh my god, what if I could deliver this? That could be funny. Okay, don't bite. This is a note. You like notes, remember? Because that was like a death threat, right? Well, here goes. Let's send a death threat to this guy. <laughs> Go, baby, for la revolucion! Oh no, I'm a bird! How could they? That's messed up. Oh, well, it's still delivered a message today. You know, not all things are bad. One of that guy's messengers. With a message for me? I know what you're up to. I've been watching. I'm coming to sprout to myself. George truly, Hector Lemans. I knew it! I knew he was out to get me the whole time! You'll never find my secret right out at all. You're going to have to find yourself another floor. Oh! The secret hideout. This coincidence of being our secret hideout as well. <laughs> Excellent. Oh! I was thinking Gladys was gone. What are you doing there, buddy? Give me that. That was that. Nuts. I guess it's the remote to the hot rod. If I touch that stuff, I'd end up with morning glory mittens. I think that would be disrespectful. Oh, it would be useful for containing it. Can I freeze it? There can't be too much in here. I'd better save it. How to collect it? I guess I need some sort of rag somewhere. No use for it. Did you say no use for it and talk to Glottis? No use for it. <laughs> I think you did just talk about a car. It seems like a line that wasn't meant to be there. Watch the crow. No use for it. What? You know, if I had a car, yeah, car okay. I was alive. Things would have been different. I saw Bowsley run down here. Where did he go? Bowsley's well, without something really helpful. What did you just say? Bowsley's probably in that maze, but I never well, got something very helpful. Without something really helpful. Mm. How about this one? Anyone down here? Go to sleep, sewer thing. What the hell could I use to find him? It wouldn't be this hand, would it? Bowsley's <laughs> probably well, I think. I feel like I need to goop before I do anything. But I, I, I don't quite know how to collect it. Because he, he doesn't want it because it's going to kill him, right? I guess we can climb back up here and see if the, there's anything. I didn't explore much up there because I figured I was done with the area. But maybe there's like an item lying around. Oh, I mean up this area, not a casino. 
The casino I feel like I exposed pretty thoroughly and I found thoroughly nothing, like extremely little. <laughs> I don't know what to find in there, it's just a bunch of guys that are unhelpful, not telling me anything. No use for it. Hot, hot. Can I heat up anything? Can I heat up my liquid nitrogen? There can't be too much in here. Is it showtime yet? Ah, Johnny Thunder still hasn't rolled in yet. You know these prima donna crooners. Hey, you're talking about Johnny Thunder. Sorry. Dad. Okay. That might be a thing later, but not now. This snowmaker is. Whoa, huge. whoa, whoa! What's this? The grinder part looks handheld. Oh my god. Aha. Uh -huh. It's a handheld grinder. Fuck. I was a very close night and I just neglected it. I feel very dumb now. <laughs> grinder. I can bri no I can't I was thinking like I could without the grinder. I could maybe grind up the hand, I thought, but it, I can't do it if I have a hold it. It's a handheld grinder. But I could do it if I put it here first. Like, I can, I can see what I, I have in my inventory at least, what I could grind up. And I don't think it's much other than this hand. Which would not be disrespectful, apparently. Happy to know his body was serving the cause like this. Oh. Yeah, it doesn't, it, that's exactly what it says. It wouldn't be disrespectful to do that. Okay, I got the grinder with the hand in it. I think that's the correct configuration. Now it's gonna find where it would be useful to, to drizzle yet? bone dust. Johnny Thunder still hasn't rolled in. I guess um, we have the necessary equipment now to traverse the maze, right? Because this could potentially make like a bone trail behind us. If I'm thinking on the same sort of wavelength as um, Manny Calavero, which <laughs> isn't always the case. <laughs> this wild guy usually gets some ideas I w would never. of bone are sprouting when they hit the puddle and turning into baby tears. Oh, right. So the puddle here as well, right? Is that is that uh, what I use with this puddle here? Is that just to show what happens? I don't know why it's not remotely close to hitting the the right thing, but I think... Oh, it's demoing how it works. I think, no, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't know why it's not even close to drizzling the bone on the right thing, but... Well, oh, never mind. Something really helpful. I was thinking, I, I, I guess I was doing the right thing though, but maybe not. There we go. This way, but I need a little light. Hey, what's that? That must be the floor's hideout. No, not that. The thing coming at us. 
<laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I had to. <laughs> Whoa, fuck! Uh, there's, a, there's a crocodile down here. I'm just gonna run it over, it's fine. <laughs> what am I doing? I, I guess he's blocking the way. I, I can run it back a little bit, but not farther than this. Then it stops. What the hell is this? Uh, hello? I can't reach that high. Oh, the remote. I'll keep him busy. It's a good thing God is doesn't afraid of anything. Oh no! Uh Okay. Wait, what? Why'd you run back here? I I guess it's just showing that I can't just go back to I can use the remote, right? That help? No, <laughs> not really. Oh, I can. Uh, I really want to do that. Pour something on it from here, though. I guess the nitrogen. There can't be too much in here. I better save it. Yeah, no. Maybe I can use my scythe to make something fall on it. Or something. No. I don't want to mess up my blade. It doesn't want to mess up his blade. See if I touch this here. It doesn't seem to doesn't seem to help. But if I drove fast enough, I could maybe get some more ground. No, I, I li literally can't. Because he just runs back into that position there. Hey, big guy, come and get me. Not picking that up. That thing is ugly. And it's in my way. Hey, big guy. Yeah, you heard me. I don't get it. Could it be the bone hand? I don't see why it would be. It's not really a weapon, it's just <laughs> it's just spraying bone dust around. This is definitely not the solution though, just climb it down here. Why does it give me that camera angle though? Oh, hang on. There's a brief moment uh, where um, I actually have control and uh, it's just standing there still. So maybe I just should just choose to do something else there. So go like down here and then go back up. What happens then? Oh, it's still facing me. Can I now put bone dust in your mouth? <laughs> no. Can I scythe you? Because I got your attention now, right? I don't want to mess up my blade. What am I doing? What's the objective? Well, I know the, oh, no, the objective is, but I just, I just, 
I don't know what I'm interacting. How I'm interacting with you. Not picking that up. That thing is a big guy. Come and get me. Yeah, you heard me. Well, this is baffling. It doesn't make a difference if the uh, car is raised or not, does it? Blip. I was hoping maybe I could make uh, Glow so sick if threw up over the, uh, uh, the uh, alligator there, or crocodile, and, you know, maybe he still has some jelly in them, and then I could freeze him. Oh, fuck me, yeah, that's not what I meant to do. Yeah, it, like... That's not what I have to do, but it's not really bad to get in there fast enough or anything. There is one thing I can do though, I can like go all the way back here. That ledge looks like a safer place to be, but can't reach. But can't reach. Okay. So just drive enough I take until I can reach it then. Place to be, but can't reach. How far that, that to be? Looks like a safer place to be, but can't reach. But can't reach. I do have to drive all the way, otherwise I can't reach. So I don't know why I would want to have my car farther back than that. There's something in here I'm missing. There must be like another thing I can interact with that that will help me. But I don't see it. I'm I'm just up here and I don't see anything I can do. I can just climb down this ladder, which is not helping at all. But if I come back up, this happens. And if I go over here, it starts snapping at me. And it's not like I can distracting. You're not missing anything here? This puzzle is... What? Gotcha, okay. I swear I've done that before already, but... <laughs> for for times of charm or whatever, how many times I tried doing that? I swear every time I try something like that, I, I feel like I've tried doing that before already, you know? <laughs> I mean it, I'm not feeling too rosy. I'm having, I feel... Listen, Bowsley, I'm not here to hurt you. Listen, Bowsley, I'm here to hurt you. I'm picking up a lot of anxiety here. Hector, is that you? It's not Hector, it's... It's not Hector, it's Manny Calavera come to sprout you. You better back off, man! That's no way to I treat an agent I'm of the LSA. That's no way to treat an agent of the LSA. I'm having... I feel... What's that? What are you doing? Are you crazy? Get back! Put your hands over your head! Put your head in your hands! Put your head in your lap! I'm thinking I better... Things are gonna change around here! It's locked. Yeah, man! They're southern shut! Hmm. Who, who, who do you think you're fooling? I love plants, is that so wrong? What if I let the, uh, the croc go now? Yeah, right. Yeah, right. Okay, he doesn't want to do that. I'm not touching any of these human remains. That's the most gruesome window display I've ever seen. I not these human remains? Same! That's Judging a by the gruesome emblem, display. These cases are full of Sproutella. Yeah, the good stuff, too. None of that slow acting fern food that I left for Hector. Fern food! Things are gonna change around here! 
Yeah, man. Who, who, who do you think you're fooling? I love plants. Is that so wrong? Plants are beautiful. You people, you think plants are dead? There can't be plants too much in life. here. There can't be too much in here. You I'd better are, save it. You are all dead. There can't be too much in here. I'd better save it. You don't deserve. What? Oh, I can leave. Okay. There can't be too much in here. I'd better save it. Oh my god, it's so loud. No. 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 It's amazing how a little touch of human remains can brighten up a place. <laughs> It's if locked. people were plants, the world would be a better place. They're southern shut. Look, I need a gun to put Hector out of business. Listen, I really need that gun. Listen, I really need that gun. You are crazy. I said get back, Hector. Don't Hector. Look, I need a gun. Can I put the I face, the, like the picture, on myself face. or something? I yeah, the agent in this photo is the poor guy that Hector who, just shot. Who, who do you think you're fooling? That's no way to treat an agent of the LSA. I love plants. Is that so? I thought maybe could look. He's in pictures, like a mask, you know. And they'd be like, "Oh, I, 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 I like that guy. He was okay." Plants are dead. Guess not. Plants are life. You all, you are all dead. How do I have so few items and things to touch here? If people would be still be so stumped. I could make everybody into plants. I've got enough juice right here to turn the world green! I've got half a mind to... I've got half a mind! What? At least he's got some of the bodies on ice. It's locked. Bodies on ice? Not picking that up. Who, who, who do you think you're fooling? I love plants. Is I guess so I haven't tried to siphon anything. I don't see how that would help me, though. Are beautiful. That soul has already you been eaten. I don't want to mess up my blade. I don't want to mess up my blade. Are I don't want to mess up my blade. I don't want to mess up my blade. You all, you are all dead. I don't want to mess up my blade. You're all the same. Oh, what's that? Hey, do you know what you just did? You just opened Pandora's box. You get out of here right now, or I'll let you have it. I'll. What? And. It's like a little tape on the bell. What did that do? Hey there, stranger. Can I help you? Uh, um, uh, I'm looking for something in a 9mm. Oh, well, I have a very pretty bouquet of that right here. There you go. Would you like some baby's bread to go with that? Sure. All right, here you go. Thank you very much. You have a great day now. Uh, very helpful. <laughs> Absolute moon logic. That thing up there was like imperceptible as well. I'm amazed I managed to spot something there. <laughs> it's like a little brown little dot up there. Okay, so now I got a gun. Sure thing, game. Yeah, like the, it was funny the outcome. I liked it, but. Any messages? I could not see that up there. Stop coming for you the day you left. They're still sending you that lingerie catalog. Memo to all agents: priority urgent. In light of the recent disappearances, all agents are ordered to avoid travel in unlit areas until further notice. Salvador, come in. Salvador. Okay, I think it's time to go to the casino, though, right? Well, I, I could talk to her. No, I already did it. She just says the same gag. Any nope. They're yeah, still yeah. sending you that lingerie catalog, though. I don't think I need to call anything for anything now. What do I need a gun for though? Like, I could see why the, having a gun is useful, of course, but how is that going to solve any puzzles for me, you know? Do I just shoot a guard? Doesn't seem like a very me thing to do. Doesn't seem very useful. Hmm, this gun might actually look nice with a little baby's breath. Bowsley was right, this is the good stuff. 
I'd probably security cameras everywhere. Yeah, it just it just puts it away. Johnny Thunder isn't gonna be happy about this. Maybe Mr. Thunder needs to spend more money on wardrobe. Oh, I keep doing it. <laughs> through the halls now. I'm on the lamb. Every time I reach for the, <laughs> the, the arrow keys. Meiji, it's me. Oh, that's Meche. Manny? That's some. Oh, I didn't realize that was Meche. Help me get Mr. High Roller here into this sheet so we can get out of here. Hey, is that you, young lady? I'll get you. Help. I'm going to punt this twerp the first chance I get. Lady. Okay. Uh, I wonder if she's intrigued by my new job. Oh, for crying out I'm loud. I'm going to punt this twerp the first chance I get. Hey! How did exactly exactly that help me? Can't like do anything about him now. Oh, what? You must be patient, my kitten. Uh, I'll escort you to your party just as soon as my system pays off here. I see. Okay. Uh, what? I have. Oh, I shouldn't skip that. She was actually talking about some stuff. Oh, I wish I knew what you said now. Mecha got this sheet for Charlie. Not again. The other machine. Special assignment just in from Salvador. Crack that machine and leave the change right away. Yes! Hey! Not funny. Oh, for crying out loud. Help! Ooh, many manis. Oh, there's a big pile of them. <laughs> Who knows much of that? It's in bone manis. Bones are the money, you know, but so are the worms. That's great. Now let's go so you can buy me a drink at the Romano. Oh, I'll meet you at the Stop station happening. with the tickets. They won't be one from me, so you'll have to go back by yourself. I'll tell that gatekeeper everything. He has to help us. Come, my lovely. I have another infallible system I'd like to demonstrate. Ow. Okay. Train station, eh? So there's just no one here now. So I don't <laughs> I don't know what I've done, but I guess I should go back to the, the headquarters the there the and line. see if anything's changed there. Because this doesn't seem to happen. Unless he has something to say to me. Johnny Thunder isn't gonna be happy about this. Those numbers are gonna be important, I swear. Needs to spend more money on wardrobe. I guess time has passed now, so maybe I can get into the um, the role of Johnny Thunder. I give that a try before I go down to see everyone. Oh, come on. But for all I know, that's just never gonna happen as well. Is it showtime yet? Ah, Johnny Th yeah, it might actually just not happen uh, at all. <laughs> it might not actually be a, a thing that I'm about to do. I mean, Manny seems to want it to happen. That's why I was like, ah, maybe I, I should try and wait for me to be able to go in there. You need a smart outfit and someone just got just. Oh, that's it! Yeah, 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 yeah of course. There's uh, gonna be something from in the bathroom.
There we go. Tight in the shoulders, but at least it doesn't reek of sled dog. Perfect. Perfect disguise. Yeah, this guy kept talking about the jacket, yeah. Hector Lamans. I just spoke with him on the phone and he's expecting me. You know Hector Lamans, eh? Cocky Ducky, then answer me this one simple question. Huh. Okay, how many limos does Hector Lamans have in his garage? Seven. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I guess you don't know Hector Lamans like I know Hector Lamans. All right, let's go, buddy. Huh. Okay. What are the odds in a million of Hector Lamans' slot machine paying out? Uh, is it twenty-three? Twenty-three. Oh, I guess you don't know Hector Lamans. All right, let's go. Oh, now he looked up. If Hector Lamont's for a cat, how many lives would he have? Five? Five? Yeah, well, that was an easy one. Too bad, I win. Best two out of three. Don't mess with me. I know Hector Lamont's. There we go. Oh, hello. You're familiar. Celso Flores, what are you doing in Hector Lamont's waiting room? Oh, he sent us out here to make up our minds about his offer. Who are you? If you don't. Oh, this is selling the, the tickets. I'm your travel agent. Oh, I have a travel agent already. But he's miles away mopping floors in an office. <laughs> no, 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 this is the guy. The is open. Who sold us the place. Oh, not sold us the place, but. We got the job there, right? And that. I guess he chased down his wife. Is this your wife, Soso? Yes, we've just returned from a lovely cruise. Well, it became lovely once I caught up with you, my little tamale. Actually, I work for Hector. He sent me to answer your questions. Eh, uh, I'll handle this, my sweet one. What can you tell me about these double-end tickets? This price seems much more than double. It's a scam. The tickets are counterfeit. Take your money and run. Ho, ho, ho. Don't try any of that tricky reverse psychology on me, my friend. The real question is, don't you feel you're worth it? I know we're worth it, but are the tickets worth it? Well, enough about you guys. Let me tell you about my problems. Actually, we have a lot of talking we need to do, so... This makeup breathes about as much as vulcanized rubber. Yes, but it brings out your strong jaw. I can't raise my arms in this suit. Well, let's just hope no one pulls a gun on you tonight, huh? I just got back from the worst vacation I've ever had. Actually, I just got back from quite an adventure myself, so... Well, I'm sure you've seen flying spiders and flaming beavers, but trust me, it gets worse. You see, I've been to the edge of the world and back. No, oh, that was the right I solution. I had no idea traveling the it land was. The was so fraught with peril. When in doubt, just complain about your life, you know? Just skip the whole thing. <laughs> Darling, come. Let us blow our nest egg together. Still alive? Yeah, I'm, 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 I've decided I'm just going to become a, a forever streamer now. Mr. Lamans, we've decided to the stream is never going, uh, not, going to not be live, actually. Excellent. The little lady changed your mind, eh? No, actually it was your agent over there. Of course. He's one of my best. Well, come on in. Let's chat, shall we? <laughs> so before, let's go. Still got oh, yeah. Let's, let's work. Let's crank it so we can get literally dozens of subscribers. I don't know who you are. <laughs> I don't know what spell you cast on the florist couple, but stick around. Once I'm done with them, there's something across town I'd like to show. Once up for 100 days. That's the dream. Or am I talking about opportunity in the general sense? I recognize the, that up is the. And frankly, we've had trouble filling them. I could really use a closer like you on the team. 
Is this my old office? This could be your office. Yeah, try this on. See how it feels. That's yours too. And as an added bonus, 2% of these, Mr. My name's Calavera, and I want a bigger cut. <laughs> oh, Mr. Calavera, I'm going to need most of these to get myself out of this world. You see, I've been a very bad boy. <laughs> I'm going to deliver those tickets to their rightful owners, and I'm going to deliver you to the compost pile. I... Oh, well, it works at least. Didn't get scammed. Just noticed that you, uh, <laughs> just responded to that cursed sand slash thing you noticed uh, that I sent you. Yes, I did send a very cursed sand slash to James. I don't know if anyone wants to see it, but it is very cursed. <laughs> I also have a picture of Electrode with legs. <laughs> but I think the most important thing was to send you the sand slash with hands. <laughs> <laughs> but not with hands in the way you think. Pigeons? Friends now? <laughs> now that I've talked about it, I, I do have to link it, don't I? There you go. <laughs> what am I doing up here? I bet I could get over to the other roof on the leg of this sign, but the legs pointed too far down and it looks like Hector blew the motor. Hmm. Well, I got a nice change of outfit at least. We were wearing that uh, big old coat for so long. It's about time we got into something more comfortable. There we go. It's cracked, but still stronger than me. Can I just shoot it? I'm saving my ammo for the big guy. You got a can full of ammo. You don't, you don't like my sand slash with hands? <laughs> I bet I could get over to the other roof on the leg of this sign, but the legs pointed too far down. Mm. Where'd it go? Oh, that's another ladder. It's the track I'm announced. No, that's the same ladder, it's just a different point of view. Okay, so where am I then, when I go here? Oh, I'm locked into this area here. There's not much I can do. So the most I can do is just go on the top of this uh, railing then, right? But why? But why? I think using that old gargoyle as a structural support for Glamour Girl here was a bad idea. It's Sproutella, not Spackle. I guess I can put a bunch of, like, bone on it and then use the goop, right? Well, so much for my third arm. There we go. Bonk? Well, it was gonna happen eventually. <laughs> you never saw. That's why I always have to break things, you know? At some point, it just had to happen. It's not my fault. Seems a bit easy. People kept keep being confused for birds in this. <laughs> it's like the second or third time this happened. Hi, Ron. Find Salvador. Get in, quick. 
were supposed to have coverage back there. Where are all of Salvador's men? I don't know. He hasn't told me yet. <laughs> told you she was a saucy backer. Hola, Manuel. Oh, this I recognize. Time for you to swing, daddy -o. Let's see you walk. Yeah, of course she's with, um... What's his face? <laughs> she does like the ma mafia types. Powers? All people Hector has sprouted? Hey, when you're on top like my boyfriend Hector is, you make a lot of enemies. Hector, that's it. What? You know, you really have bad taste in men. Yes. No, I have a taste for really bad men. There's... Does that have a gun? She took a gun! My cat! I thought I told you to scat, man. Mm, bye. Oh, hang on, what's that? You tell me the spy was a spy? <laughs> Unbelievable! How could you betray me like this? Yeah, right. Hmm. Hector supplies water to keep the flowers alive. Nice, I'm gonna poison the old greenhouse then. I just find, I need to find some way to put in the Look, tiptoe through the tulips already. Not allowed to check out the trunk. She'll have to leave at some point. Once he's done once she's done doing a sassy pose or whatever, she's she has to leave. <laughs> Oh, Manny, go! Jeez. Definitely putting something in the tubes, though. Hello? Anyone in here? Nope. Maybe if I go through the front door. She loves me. She loves me not. Well, you're half right. Oh, Manny. So cynical. What happened to you, Manny, that caused you to lose your sense of hope, your love of life? I died. I see. <laughs> I guess Domino is right. You don't have a shred of optimism. Well, when it comes to shreds, Dom is the expert. And by that same logic, Manny, you're about to become an expert in botany. Is this where you tell me all about your secret plan, Hector? How you stole double-end tickets from innocent souls, pretended to sell them, but really hoarded them all for yourself in a desperate attempt to get out of the land of the dead? No. Nah. <laughs> this is where you writhe around in excruciating pain for about an hour because that idiot Bowsley ran off with all their fast acting Sproutella. The slow stuff will sprout you, but it's going to take a long time, I'm sorry to say. <laughs> Manny, where are you going? You've got some time, you know, before you have to leave. <laughs> Get it? Leave. <laughs> like leaves? <laughs> sure, I get it. The last one to explain the joke. Dale. Gracias, Toto Santos. Ooh, counting your tickets, are we? Sure would be a shame if I were to just go and get my gun. Come on, shake it for me, baby. One of you must be mine. Yeah, that it. Anything? Hmm. 
he truly gave his body to the cause. There's a gun in the trunk of this car, but the trunk key is with my body somewhere in the meadow behind the greenhouse. Find it! Right, and tell Leva that I know she will guide the Alliance wisely when I am gone. For when I bite this explosive tooth, the deadly cloud will sprout not just my target, but me as well. Your target? What are you... Hey, get out of there! Farewell, my friend! What were you talking about with the head of the LSA in there? The head of the LSA. Huh, Sal? Got something you want to share with the class? Only this. Viva la revolucion! Ah! Good job, Sal. He truly gave his body to the cause. <laughs> Even more so this time than last time. <laughs> He's fine right where he is. Not picking that up. Tickets? Hey! Oh, it's Masai! I'll take that. Well, what do you know? Sal had a ticket all along. Because it did. It's locked. Yoink. <laughs> My ticket now. Amazing how Salvador's ticket is still drawn to him. Oh! I can find his body behind the greenhouse in the meadow. Wow, they really couldn't have made this place any huger, could they? <laughs> Fuck me. I'm not doing anything now. Okay. Not here. It's up here then. I think it's a meta behind the green eyes, right? So like here? Seems to be attracted to something over this way. I'm not doing anything now. Ah, time for a nice game of hot and cold. My favorite. At least I didn't have to like reactivate it each time. It did just like do the thing the moment it got close. Which is always the, the bad thing about like hot and cold in some games, but it like make you go to that's nice. Make a pillow like hot and cold, but then you'll have to like keep mashing the thing and like wait for cooldowns and stuff. Ugh, so annoying. Really makes me hate uh, that as mechanic. Like archaeology and wow. Oh, so annoying. It's the worst. This must be the key to Salvador's trunk. It only works on Salvador's trunk, I'll bet. That's usually how keys work. I already searched him pretty thoroughly. He's fine right where he is. I already searched him pretty thoroughly. I just... I just check all the options. You never know. Maybe one of them is gonna get me my gun. Oh. That's a nice key jingle. Ah. Lovely. This makes me feel nice, hearing that jingle. I've... It's like a Diablo 2 in me or something. It, it's just... It feels like the sort of sound you'd get from a game like that. When a key drops or something. <laughs> ah, yes. Lots of ammo. Beautiful. Freeze, Hector. Yeah, you heard me. Okay, I don't think we need to shoot him, though. I am pretty confident that... We haven't done anything about this thing here either. I'm pretty sure we just shoot this thing a bunch, right? Or like, put it inside somewhere. I think that's what you do. Bang, 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 bang. I had a feeling. That doesn't sound good. There must have been a reason why it was like a massive tube going all the way to the greenhouse and like it explicitly showed it going in as well. I was like, there's no way this isn't gonna be how I kill him. Ooh, okay. That's not like any plant I know. 
A very goopy plant. Oh, it, it left this fez though. That's nice. It's a fez for me. I think we did it. I think that's the end. <gasps> I guess Manny got a ticket in the end. You can count them if you want. They're all here. How about yours? The company gave me one on the other end. Sort of a retirement present. And, uh, demons ride free, right? Aw, oh, man, you know I can't go with you. I'm a spirit of the land and all that. I can't ever leave this world. I guess I got so wrapped up in saving people, I just assume I'd be able to save you too. Yeah, but I don't need to be saved. I like it here. I'm not all alone in that basement anymore, thanks to you. I got a new job and all these new friends. I'm a big demon success story. So, I guess this is it then. I like his mohawk. Give me, a, give me a hug. <laughs> you were the best boss I ever had. Bye. Honk. Manny? Yeah? When we get to the next world... What is it, Angel? Are we going to be together? You know, sweetheart, if there's one thing I've learned, it's this. Nobody knows what's gonna happen at the end of the line. So you might as well enjoy the trip. Oh. Nice. We did it. We finished the game. That I I finished it too fast. I I didn't think it was gonna be done already. Um I really thought I was like gonna stream and like be barely able to have enough game um before uh, before leaving May. But now we're gonna have to find another game. <laughs> we're gonna have to find another game to play now. <laughs> it's fine. It's okay. Hey, Griffin Tank was, was great. This is a great time. Um, there were only a couple instances per episode, which I felt like had absolute moon logic. And most of the time I was like, yeah, this is pretty intuitive and makes sense. But most of the time, the, the puzzles were actually not bad. <laughs> I had a really good time with this. Uh, definitely like a game that um, really holds up. Aside from the, the weird like crashes that kept happening every now and then. I don't know how I managed to keep breaking the game. Um, man concerned about running out of game does five hour stream. To be fair, I did, like, know vaguely that this game was about to end, and I, like, went for it, yes. So, <laughs> it is my fault. But I was also, like, at the end of the um, game, I was like, this is probably not going to be a damaged game for me. If, like, to do another stream of this. Which is always awkward. I always have, like, a, a difficult time with games when, like, I do an hour of game and then I have to switch to another game. Because, like, I, I like deciding what games you play. Um, before streaming, you know. I hear Norco is pretty short. The fuck is Norco? <laughs> is that the actual name of the thing? It's a company, apparently. Oh, that is the game. Yeah, Norco. Southern Gothic point and click narrative adventure in a, immerses the player in the sinking suburbs and verdant industrial swamps of a distorted uh, South Louisiana. Oh, this looks this looks great. The art is gorgeous, and it's been on Game Pass since today. 
I oh, thank you. Thank you very much for the heads up. Thank you, friend. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, it, I, I do want to play some more Point of Week, so that could be a thing. Yeah, I, I, I really enjoyed Grim Fandango. It's, I, I've been wanting to play this game for so long. This is like a pre-old game at this point, and it's been so long. So I'm, I'm happy. I'm once again happy we finally got around to doing it. And I think this was a great start to play more Point of Click as well, down the line. How did I not get every achievement? There's an, ach there's an achievement in this game? To play the whole game with tank controls. <laughs> and it's called The Right Way. <laughs> No quite definitely a reader through the for this one. Ah, I see. I see. Because I did I did quite like that there's voice acting in this, it helps a lot, but I can always narrate as well. I, I think it's fine. As long as pe other people don't think it's annoying. <laughs> I'm I'm alright narrating. Let's skip this cutscene. Oh no, that's it! That's the game. Oh my god, is it's going right back to the start of the game again. <laughs> Yeah, that's the game. I guess I'll... I'm, it's so late now. I, I, I think that should probably do it for, for the stream for now. Um, yeah, that's almost five hours. I was like kind of thinking, like, maybe I should like go right into playing another game right now. What if, what if you play like three hours of some Guilty Gear right now? I'll just keep going, but it's probably a good time for me to take a break. <laughs> Let everyone go. <laughs> Release everyone. So, yeah, 24 hours, sure, let's go. I feel like I have the energy to keep going, but... I'm alright, I'm alright right to take a break here. Hi. Right. Cheers. Cheers for coming and hanging out. I hope you had a great time with the stream. And uh, I hope you really enjoyed Grim Fandango. Thank you very much. Um, I'll be thinking about what game we play next in the meanwhile. Uh, but we'll be playing some games on Tuesday. Uh, and we'll see what I, f uh, what I find. I have no ideas right now, so we'll see. Alright, cheers. Good night, take it easy. Bye!